Hello everybody and welcome to another live stream. What is going on? It took a while to set up today's game. Oh my goodness. What's up JM? What's up Joshua? What's up Sage? What's up Bevo? What's up Jax? Aaron, I've got a cat who just jumped into my lap. You ready? Here comes the kitty. Here comes the kitty. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this cat. What a kit. What a cat. I do hope that uh, my microphone is working today. Oh good, it is working. That's good. That's a good good update. Good update. Yeah, no, it took me like a full... I think it took an hour... It basically took a full over an hour to, uh, to set up the game today. These old school games are very difficult to set up. So, it's different for each one of what I actually have to do every time. For today's game, I have to do the, uh, the classic the classic strategy of turning off and unplugging my top monitor. So I only get one screen today. I don't know why I put up two fingers. I only get one screen today, and my cat is trying to attack my earbud. Uh, one screen, and I'm going to be having to do the thing that I have done on previous live streams, wherein chat is on my phone, and my phone is being placed next to my camera. Alex G has become a member! Thank you, sir. Thank you for joining the team. Alex G, we appreciate you. We appreciate you. What's up, Columbia? Hello. Uh, Jax is becoming... Are, aren't you guys already members? Is this just like... How is the... How is that... Is this the regular membership, like, day or something? I don't know. I don't know how that emoji pop-up even works. Ah, but good to see you all today. Uh, we are indeed going to be playing Spongebob Typing today. Uh, ma'am, if you could not chomp onto my earbuds. She is just actively monching. She's actively monching. I need to get her, I need to get her out. Ma'am. 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 Ma'am, that's my earbud. That's my earbud. Ma'am. Ma'am. <laughs> Do you see? I don't know. I'm trying to see if you can physically see when she's doing this. Oh, you're stuck in my chair? Ah, oh, yeah, you're in a strap. You're gonna, you're gonna grab it? Listen. Listen, ma'am. This is not gonna work. <laughs> don't chew me. Yeah, they're already members, so it might have been, like, as the month reset it was like resetting their counter all right <clears throat> let me move my microphone really quick there we go the cat has jumped off oh i'm free i'm free how do you become a member uh they don't make it very easy to see on mobile for some reason but on desktop you can see that there's a become a member button it, it co it's one dollar technically 99 cents i made it as cheap as youtube would let me make it so it's the cheapest it could possibly be just because we need to, uh, so somebody recommended having a stream soon where we make a new batch of emojis to replace the currently available emojis. Like, Jax just used two of them. Um, and so we're going to have a stream at some point soon where we create some new emojis and reset that so that you guys can enjoy them and use the ones you want. And we don't have to keep them to Spongebob. At this point, I'm just, if you guys want to see some types of emojis, let me know and we'll, we'll add some emojis to the, we'll have to swap out old ones. So we'll keep whatever you guys want to keep and we'll swap out the other ones. But... Oh boy, if you guys are ready, we can go ahead and jump into this game. I have zero expectations outside of the fact it's a typing game, and I haven't done a typing game since I was in middle school. Like, legitimately, when I was learning to type early on and learning how to speed type, that's kind of the last time I played a typing game. We're gonna be jumping right into it. So, so yeah, uh, <laughs> it's been a long time. I hope, uh, I hope I don't embarrass myself today. I've been on the computer and I've been on the internet for basically what it feels like my entire life. And if I can't type fast, or type correctly with not looking at the keyboard, this can be very embarrassing. I think I'm good though. I think I'm pretty proud of my typing skills. Again, 26 year old, I think I got this. I think I got this. That, that could age horribly within the next 10 minutes. We're gonna find out. All right, let's get started. I'm gonna start recording as we jump into this. I'll have to turn off Spotify music. Boop. Oh, and look at this. You can see that I... <laughs> look, look how badly... Like, <laughs> Oh, the mouse. <laughs> Spotify has been broken for a while, and so I just have to screen record Spotify itself, which causes the fact that you can just... Actually, I could turn off the mouse for my recording so that you guys didn't have to see that. Um, and maybe I'll do that going forward. Okay. This is going to look broken for a second. Is... Hello. Hello. It's going to look broken for a second. Don't worry about it because I have to start the game. Whoop. Okay. And here we go, SpongeBob SquarePants typing. Let's get started. Uh, yes, I would like to launch the game. Thank you very much. Okay. Ah, and it's working! Okay, so this is the game. I actually have to move my microphone because I realize I can't see the game on this bottom monitor. 
So our options, <clears throat> our options at the start are play, user's guide, sailorific stuff, visit us online. I feel like this website's not going to exist anymore. Also, if I click this, it's going to really glitch out weird because, again, these old games are so tiny that you're really looking at a very small portion of my screen, and so it's really pixelated. Register? No. Uninstall! <laughs> have you ever seen a video game have the uninstall button in the main menu? I sure haven't. What is Sailorific stuff? You can get a screensaver! <laughs> um... Well, oh shoot, is it not technically because I restarted my computer? Oh, uh, I'll have to, like, go do that. Okay. Okay, I'll have to check that out later. Because I had it, I had it installed, and now when I, I had to restart my computer just to get the game to work. So we'll have to check out the Sailorific stuff later. Um, we'll check it out at the end of the stream. If you, nah, should I just do it now? Let me, let me see if I can just do it now. Hold on, let me exit the game. And I just gotta figure this out now. Okay, so make sure that the game disc is correctly loaded into my computer. I'm gonna go boop 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 Sorry, you're gonna see nothing while I do this because I have to go into the deep depths of my computer and make things work, but I wanna see what they meant by background. This might like break my computer background. It doesn't matter because I have a folder that has all my pictures. So if this ruins my normal desktop background cycle, uh, I won't miss out on much. Uh, which one is it? I think it's, I think it's that. And boop. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so now, now the game is actually plugged into my computer. So hopefully it should see that I have the CD. What's up, Dylan? What's up, SB? How you doing? The video has two Mario heads doing steamed hams in The Simpsons. I don't know what that is. Screensaver! Did it crash the game? Install screensaver. What is this? <laughs> Wait, is that the screenscape saver? They want me to install this? I guess I don't have an option. Oh gosh, am I gonna click this button? I feel, I feel like I'm gonna click this button. This is the most like... That's it? Okay, wait a minute. Let's exit. Let's see if that's done anything to my computer. Screen saver is not the same thing as a desktop background. Oh shoot, I think that's gonna... I think screen saver is... Ah, oh, screen savers are... I forgot about screen savers, actually. Screen savers are the old school way to make your screen not bleed the same colors over and over. So when your computer falls asleep, which my computer actually doesn't do. I physically don't think I can show to you this on stream if it happens. I'd have to turn off my, I'd have to change the sleep settings on my computer so that it would fall asleep. And then when it falls asleep, it could play a screen saver. And normally that would just be like a, oh, it would play a little animation. And I don't know if you guys have ever seen those, the old school pipe animation that used to be on old computers. That's a screensaver. I forgot what screensaver actually meant for a while there. So, okay, I guess I've just installed a screensaver onto my computer that won't really do anything because my computer never goes to sleep. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Let's play the game. Hi there. To sign in, oh. type in your name or find it on the list. Then get ready to typey type. Oh my gosh, Tom Kenny voice acting. I, I always love these classic games have some like long lost Tom Kenny voice acting and it's so great to hear. Okay, so. Jay. Oh dear. Oh. Oh no, wait, can I make SpongeBob just say anything? Oh no, we have Tom Kenny saying every letter. L. Oh, L. Oh dear, that's power. That is power in my hands. Oh my gosh. J C H A S E F I L M S. That spells me. Oh, this is amazing. What are some acronyms that like are good acronyms? I O L F. He's got like the same cadence to every letter that he voice acts. Uh, what are other good? A I. Yeah, <laughs> A I before it. It basically is kind of a very shortened, um, you know, uh, what is it in in Team Fortress um, animations? They they the old style before they used AI voices. They would like 
voice bash or something. It's where you would take the voice acting and cut it up into really weird pieces. Kind of like the YouTube poop style. I don't think there's any other acronyms I can make SpongeBob say that would be funny. Um, Cause he's just gonna say the letters. So you really have to go with acronyms. Uh, oh, is he not gonna say the numbers? E. F, F, F. Sentence mixing. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel. I hoped one of you would know. Thank you. That's exactly what I was looking for. P, O, I, U, Y, T. Oh, he's really excited to say T. T, 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 Okay, we gotta try out every letter. I'm sorry. I, E, W, Q, A, S, T. D, T, D, T, D, T, D, T. This is ridiculous. F. I feel like every kid who actually got to play this game when they were younger did the exact same thing I'm doing right now. G, H, J, K, L. He's not gonna say weird symbols. It's actually not gonna let me type in weird symbols. Oh, that's the end of. I, okay, I gotta restart. So no weird symbols. Z, S. Why is Z, Z in that font? Z. Everything else looks normal. And then Z is the thinnest little, like, font I've ever seen. What is that? Z, X, C, V, B, N, M. Okay, so here's the fun letters. B, T. <laughs> what was the other one? I think it was, like, E. I don't know. Uh, e e N. All right, there's my name. I swear, if the game just crashes right there, I'm going to be so upset. <laughs> what? The learning company, okay. <laughs> what kind of start to a game is this? Thank you, learning company. Amazing. I'm excited to play your game from 2004. Yeah, another Nickelodeon animation I've never seen. They have so many different um, logos. All right, SpongeBob SquarePants typing. Let's see if they've been throwing away me slightly used pickles. Hello? What's this? Come on, open up! What's all the racket? This cash register is broken and I can't get me money out. Mr. Krabs, that is a typewriter. Does it make I know, why can they never get Mr. Krabs' voice uh, actor? Ooh, I can get it to make money. Wordy burger. Come and get it! Two weeks These are like hell. SpongeBob in real life quality animations right here. <laughs> okay, that didn't work. But I have another idea. Where's SpongeBob in this cutscene? You expect people to compete for a peanut butter and jellyfish jelly sandwich? Did someone say peanut butter and jellyfish jelly sandwich? Are we competing against Patrick or are we Patrick? Oh gosh, there's no way that all these people... Wait, he's getting in line too? <laughs> he is in bigger movies at the time, yeah. SpongeBob. Do you even know what you're This is like the classic for? era yep. of like flash it's animations too. This is just a flash animation of SpongeBob. No. I love The tweens are so <laughs> obvious. No, 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 not tapping. It's a typing tournament. Oh. Do you even know how to type SpongeBob? No, but my friend will have This is like the only official tap, SpongeBob right? product with like tween animation in it. Really work. You have my typing like uh, no, I meant this friend. Ha, good luck. You'll need it. They know we're here! They're watching Welcome us! Welcome to Bikini Bottom! Okay. We're really excited about that big typing tournament. Okay. To hone your skills, click on the practice area. Click I on the Glove World billboard to check out some fun games. Click on the Krusty Krab to enter into the tournament. Okay. And if you want to quit, click on the anchor. For options, click on the like preserver. Jeez, it's almost like all those things were physically written on the signs and buttons that you can press, with the exception of Glove World. Uh, okay, I like the uh, the leg warmers, the 90s leg warmers on the, the jellyfish. Click on the crust. Okay, no, we're good. We're just gonna, okay. Hey, we're in the practice area. Oh Did no! Practice? He's got click 10 fingers. At the top of the screen to choose a topic. We've got a lot of stuff to pick from. 
Choose any of these 10 subtopics. Wow, they now, got a, a lot of SpongeBob voice acting. In the typing area, see the virtual keyboard. Virtual. These hands will show you how to properly type the next letter in the lesson. Yes. If you're having trouble, look here. Teach me. If you want to try this? Teach me, SpongeBob. Again? No problem. Click the start over button. This okay. counter shows your words per minute. Oh. How many words you can type in a minute. Here's where, I, here's where I'm absolutely going to be embarrassed. This shows you how much of the lesson you've completed. Okay. Click the life preserver to go to the options This words screen. per minute thing is going to be the make or break to or how skilled I am as an internet person. Quit. If you need me to explain anything again, no. just click on me. No, I don't. SpongeBob SquarePants. You just talked for a Good full luck. minute. I'm I don't need you to talk typing. again. Thank you. Bye, bye, bye. Okay. Ripped pants. Ripped pants. Am I supposed to just type those words? What am I doing? Okay, typing doesn't do anything yet. Ripped pants. Okay, here we go. Oh, they have the paragraph symbol and everything. Uh, so, oh shit, sure. So, yeah, shift R. I mean, I know how to do this. What are they recommending finger-wise for that? They're recommending the pinky finger for that? It's kind of hard to see. You can barely see what's going on there. But yeah, they're... Oh, I actually don't use the pinky finger for the P button. I use my middle finger, which is probably not good form. Oh no. I do! I use my, my, not my, I use my ring finger to press P. I'm just gonna be learning. Okay, these are all I'm using correctly. Oh, oh, wait. Okay. And then, yeah, oh, the, the enter symbol. I'm too used to, like, I don't think I can unlearn that. I don't think I can... Yeah, you want me to... Okay, Spongebob was at the beach with sand. I know my words per minute is going to be crap. Oh, I had to look down for the for the com the comma. Telling j Oh, crap. Jokes and being silly. I can do this. I can do this. I'm a good typer. I'm a good typer. <laughs> really started laughing when he ripped his pants. Is this like the song lyrics? And everyone on the beach started laughing too. I've completely ruined my... Okay, I did that one correctly. Sponge... Uh, okay. Yeah, it's not my fault. I, actually, I should know how to type Spongebob correctly because I, you know, how many times have I had to... Uh, is it showing me like how many mistakes I've made or is that going to show up more when we do the competition? All right. I think, for the most part, I do all of the letters correctly. I'm just interested to see if any of these letters... P is the only one that's surprising me. Pinky for P does not feel comfortable. I think I'm... I, I, I gotta stick with what I've learned and what I've stuck into my brain for over 10 years of typing now. Okay. Alright, let's get out of here, because, I mean, this is just gonna be practice. This isn't interesting. So, so let's... What are all these things? There's a lot of stuff. Driving me crazy, driving me crazy, 101. Okay. Driving me crazy, 101. Are these the things that we're going to be tested on in the actual test? Is this like a way to practice? You get your finger memory? Oh gosh, the numbers I have to always look down for. Uh, and I'm not used to seeing that symbol actually be the enter symbol. Like sure, you get it in Microsoft Word, but I'm... I'm just not used to seeing that and be like, oh, I have to press the enter button right now because it says that I have to press the enter button. Uh, so Mrs. Puff decided to teach a nice, safe class on basket weaving. Okay. What are these stories? Uh, but when Mrs. Puff saw who her students were, her heart sank. Co oh, no. Capital. Come in, Sponge... Oh, come on! Capitalizing the second B is so confusing. And Patrick... Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Maybe playing a typing game was a mistake, she said miserably. How long are these, like, stories gonna be? Because I'm interested to see if there's any funny storytelling in all of this, but at the same time, I don't want to sit here slowly uncovering the mystery of the story. Oh, why do they have to put so much punctuation? Uh... <laughs> I haven't looked at chat in a while because I'm so trying to like match the letters here. Are you guys like totally making fun of uh, <laughs> my typing skills? Because I feel like you might be. Um, the stream is lagging for you. The last time you did typing was type learn. Who else remembers cursive writing? Oh, cursive writing, dude. Yeah, that is the same era of learning how to type correctly is cursive writing, which I think they've fully removed from schooling these days. I, I don't know. Do, do any of you, have any of you done, I think most of you guys are probably at least in high school or middle school and 
middle school might be the time when they're doing cursive. What's the last time you guys did cursive? Or for those of you who just recently went to like early high school or late uh, middle school, did you guys even do cursive? Because I think for most schools... Okay, what is going on in the storyline? Puff turned to see Patrick waving his disembodied arm in the air? My arm fell off when I got into my chair. Okay, yeah, no, the story is getting interesting. I, I stopped paying attention and I was just typing letters. And then I saw the word disembodied arm on my screen. Uh, okay. Curse of writing, good times. Fourth grade is when you did a basket. It is, no, she's doing basket weaving because I guess she was trying to get away from uh, doing the... It is, was it boating school 101 was the, the, the category of this. Um, but nonetheless, we're basket weaving, and for some reason, Patrick has lost his arm entirely. Oh, for heaven's sake! Patrick? Oh, I hate the punctuation. It was always my worst part of this. Maybe I'm literally going to get better at typing from this. You can, <laughs> either I'm going to get better at typing, or I'm just going to further prove how, how I've learned wrong lessons. And how often I have to actually look down at my keyboard is uh, pretty bad. Uh... That's the whole story. Oh, for heaven's sake, Patrick, Mrs. Puff said, hurrying to tape it back on. <laughs> okay, so the full story. Mrs. Puff decided to teach a nice safe class on basket weaving, but when Mrs. Puff saw who her students were, her heart sank. Come in, Miss SpongeBob and Patrick, she said miserably. Take your seats. Uh, Mrs. Puff asked Patrick. Mrs. Puff turned to see Patrick waving his disembodied arm in the air. My arm fell off when I got into my chair. Well, for heaven's sake, Patrick. She said, hurrying to tape it. Print? It's actually printing it on my printer! <laughs> this game is so old that it just expects you to have a printer correctly connected. And I do, because I need a printer in my day-to-day -day life. How is this gonna print? What font is it gonna use? Let me check my printer to see like if it's having any issues. It started but then stopped. Do we have paper? I've got paper. Is it gonna try? I think it gave up. My printer made a noise and then it just gave up. Hold up, I gotta I gotta get the printer to work here. I'm gonna try it again. I don't think it's gonna work. There is a- there is somewhere where it just fully crashes and it doesn't want to send all the way through. I don't know. I'll update you guys if that suddenly pops out of the printer later during the stream. Uh, <laughs> I want to see what they'll- like, what format would you print on a regular piece of paper? This! What- what would you print it? How? Would they just, like, straight type it out? That's really funny. Okay, well, there's a lot. So, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten? So, they have 50 practice. The SpongeBob files are probably actually stories. What, SpongeBob what is Square who's pants. who? Okay. Sp SpongeBob SquarePants. Oh dear, what is, what is this like? <laughs> X Files, full name Sponge. Bob's. Oh, where's the Q? Square <laughs> pants. Occupation. Fry cook at the. Oh no. The. Oh no. The. Oh no. Krusty Crab. Meh. About. Okay, this is just like the standard stuff. Can I just like skip and see the story quicker? Yeah, we can. SpongeBob's best friends in the whole world are Patrick Starr and Sandy Cheeks. She thinks Squidward. He thinks Squidward is his best friend too, but Squidward thinks Spongebob is the most annoying creature in Bikini Bottom. Spongebob loves going jellyfishing. Boy. Try again. I know you'll do better next time. Well, they won't reveal the story unless I do better, I guess. I want to see that thing print so bad. Um, okay, wait. Let's go to... Sea Poems? Oh, so needlefish. Bikini Bottoms got him! Anemone, enemy. There are so many lines of Tom Kenny voicing. Ocean colors scene. I hope he got paid well for this, because he spent like probably a long That's time in the booth. That's amore. Send a dollar, sans cents. Send a dollar, sans cents. 
That is a very fancy line delivery. The sardine that wanted to be free. How to catch a yellow snapper. <laughs> Word fish swordfish. Ooh. Oh, th is that gonna be like a interesting? That's gonna be like a typing. I feel like that's actually gonna be an interesting Word, challenge. Word fish swordfish. Word fish swordfish. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Word fish. S oh no. Swordfish. Should. Okay. Should you be thrust into the sea? Where swordfish faint and fake. This is cool language. Uh, feign lots of interest or you'll... Is this like an actual... Are there writers on this game who came up with this? Because right now this is actually just a very interesting, like, poem making a pun between sword fighting and a swordfish. It's a good pun. You'll witness, then, when overboard, that they just want to play. And as they are just overboard, <laughs> dude, okay, who wrote this? Use wit in what you say. And should they ever? This is reminding me of when I wrote the script for our uh, Christmas episode. The Christmas episode was very fun to write the, the puns and the like rhyming words. Uh, it was really great. And should they ever want to fence, their swordplay is recoiled. Just play with words in your defense. Defense is ironic, not uh, unironically, an actual word that I have difficulty spelling from time to time. Uh, you will have them boiled. Oh, how long is this? Yes, wordplay is defensive fun. If you go overboard, for every swordfish knows the pun is mightier than the sword. The pun is mightier than the sword. That's good. Oh, that was like a good poem. That was weird. Someone should make a song cover of the poems. Yeah. Uh, what's going? This is crazy. So sea poems is unironically actually interesting. I feel like the rest of these are. Oh, flat's, flat's the, flounder. the flounder. Let's flat's see. Let's see. Flounder. Flounder. Okay. Little name. Gosh. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Okay. I don't care about mess ups. I just want to get through this. Flats the flounder. Our oh, occupation bully. Perfect. That's his. That's his. What he's paid for. About. Ah, uh, he's big. Oh gosh. Get get on the correct grid. He's bad. <laughs> shush. 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 I'm just. I'm just going through fast. I don't want to actually like. He's a bottom feeder. And he's going to kick Spongebob's butt! Yeah, he's gonna do that. Okay, this is maybe less interesting. I don't think I care about the who's who anymore. And Spongebob is scared of him and he thinks about driving Spongebob's class. When Flats the Flounder looks uh, at Spongebob with those weird two eyes on the same side of his face. <laughs> Alright, let me just get a couple more letters correctly so we can like spam our way through the rest of this. Oh my gosh, if only, if only I could type correctly, that would be amazing. Alright. The same side of his face. Well, Spongebob just about freaks out. That's why he's so mad at Spongebob anyway. Since Spongebob's just a very committed student who likes keeping all of his pencils in a row. Try one more time. Just for me. Come so on, they're saying please. that Flats is a bully because... Because he's jealous of how good Spongebob is at schooling? Um, I don't know if I believe that. I don't know if I believe- See facts! Oh, are these gonna be like actual facts about real fish? What do you guys wanna learn about? Pick one. First, first comment, pick one. Uh, salty sea tails. What do they mean by salty sea tails? This sounds like it's gonna be just- These top three seem like they're gonna be the most interesting here. Starfish? Okay, let's check out starfish. Starfish, starfish. Starfish. Starfish, or sea stars, correct, are not fish, but they are hard skinned animals. Oh, I thought I was gonna say mammals. I'm like, I doubt that. No, they like, they, they self duplicate by like splitting apart. Uh, they live on 
<laughs> not the on the rocky sea floor. Trust me, I I I I'm doing great at this game. Don't worry about it. They have pointy bits, <laughs> projections all over their body. That's like the spiky texture, right? Of a starfish is what they're talking about. The projections. There are over two uh, two. I got okay thousand different. Wait, what num? What? Okay, ring finger. I use that correct finger. Yeah. They only use the middle finger. That's actually something I don't do quite often. And then pinky. Uh, my pinky isn't dexterous enough. I don't use my pinky for literally any typing besides the shift button. I bet you I could have been a way better, like, person to play the piano and stuff if I had actually practiced using my pinky on keyboarding. But I don't. I don't use my key... my pinky. I use my left pinky a lot, actually. I correctly use my left pinky. My right pinky is just, like... A limp noodle, like I just don't use it when I type. I'm starting to discover, like, preconceived false habits, I guess. There's 2,000 species of starfish worldwide. Starfish have no spine, and they move very slowly along the seabed using hundreds of tiny tube feet. The common starfish is about four inches across. Most starfish have five arms, uh, but some have more. If a starfish loses an arm, the new one will grow in its place. Starfish do not have a brain. Well, that explains Patrick. All right. Is there more? Starfish are easily stranded by the outgoing tide because they're unable to move quickly. I mean, this is just like regular sea facts. I kind of, I'm, I'm getting, getting kind of bored, you know? All of this learning. I'm learning how to type and I'm learning how to, how about how starfish work. I'm like, ugh. Boring. Give me my punny poems again. Plus, my words per minute is absolute garbage, and my my actual like accuracy in this is Try horrible too. All right, time. more practice. Let's go to salty sea tails. Mermaids. Mermaids. This is just gonna be like, it's gonna be like the the kind of story of what mermaids and how they kind of the lore started. So yeah, this is just gonna be like an actual history history like lesson. Many sailors throughout history have claimed to see mermaids while at sea. Oh, I can't spell the word throughout worth my own salt uh we're gonna get to the mini games soon but i just wanted to check out all these because there's so much to look at so i don't know they claim to see mermaids and see the creatures were described as having the body and head of a woman but the tail of a fish sometimes they're described as beautiful and helpful others believe them to be wicked creatures who wanted to trick sailors into jumping overboard let's let's start typing correctly so we can read the rest of it um who wanted to trick sailors into jumping overboard with the intention of drowning them. Is that it? Try again. That was it. I know you'll do better next All time. All right, that was pretty simple and boring. So sea poems and the sponge files are moderately interesting. The sardine that wanted to be free actually sounds like a good poem. The sardine that wanted to be free. I want to hear Tom Kenny voice the entire thing. Like that's what you really should unlock. The sardine that wanted to be the sardine that wanted the fact, to be free. You have to like free. double click it, which just makes Tom Kenny spam his voice line. All right. We gotta do it the way he did. The sardine that wanted to be free. You gotta capitalize the beginning of everything in the title here, besides the two and the B. To be free. A rash, sorry, let me put my mouse out of the way. A rash sardine was such a fool. Gotta, I, I can't type as fast as I can talk. He swam off from his crowded school. Yeah, here we go with our rhyming poetry. Whoops. He loved to learn. That wasn't the case. What? Wait, what? Oh, 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 plot twist! Plot twist, he doesn't like learning. Um, he simply wanted much more space. I don't know if I'm quite understanding the dialogue and how they're writing it. The school's close quarters cramped his style, so off to swam. Off he swam after a while. Oh, here we go. I'm free, he cried, but then he met a fisherman who had a net. All right, let's get a couple more of these correctly typed in just so we can quickly do this. Oh, my words for me is amazing. But the cra his crowded state, he wished to lessen. What, because he was in the net? He's like, oh, I'm so crowded with all these other fish in this fishing net. Uh, he wished to lessen, but now he's really learned a le Oh, he wanted to get out of his crowded state at the school, but by ditching, he's now caught and he's gonna get eaten. This is literally like a kind of, like, Boy Who Cried Wolf style story. 
but not Boy Who Cried Wolf. It's more of just like, a, oh, it's a cautionary tale. Stay in school, kids, because if you ditch school, you might get, like, kidnapped. <laughs> he landed in a net. Then a tin! Boy's getting eaten! Now look at what a jam he's in. Ah, oh, alright guys, stay in school or else you will literally be put into a, a can and you're gonna get eaten. I'm sorry, that's the way the world works. That's how Mafia works. Ah, oh, these are good. These poems are, are pretty good print. Nothing's gonna happen. My, my poor printer doesn't even know. It's just like, what are you giving me? You're giving me ones and zeros and they don't make sense. Stop. Stop. It really hasn't, like, it gave up after the first one. It made some noises when when I first tried, and then past that, it's just like, bro, what are you doing? I, I can't print your video game, thank you very much. Uh... It is Dr. Seuss for Spongebob. Alright, let's do one more Sponge Files before we go and actually play the, the competition. Squeaky Boots, Sharp Dressed Man, Spongebob the Maestro. These all sound pretty interesting. Um, fight for your right to party. Fight for your right to party. Fight for your... Why is... Wait, why is for and your not capitalized? Are those not supposed to be capitalized? I disagree with that. I feel like your can be capitalized. I don't know why I just started typing the word party. SpongeBob went... I gotta put my ass out of the way. Uh, to see Patrick one day. Oh no. What's he gonna do? Go jellyfishing? What's he gonna do? I don't know. I can't see the next sentence. Uh, Patrick! He is... I should just... All of these can become like animations that we just make. He called outside of Patrick's house. I'm in here, Spongebob. Great. <laughs> what a follow-up. That is the most un-Patrick like... Li I'm in here, Spongebob. Like, that's very much non-official writers for Spongebob, just writing dialogue for these characters. Patrick said, oh, my least favorite thing to ever write when I'm typing things is, the pat is like, the character said. It's the most cl I know, I know, it makes sense, and it's fine when you read it, but typing out, like, character said is the most clunky thing. I, I don't know, I never liked typing that out. It was my least favorite part of story writing. It's like, I just want to... You know, like, that's why I like writing scripts, because you, you just write the character's name, and then boom, you know that they're saying the line. You don't have to actually care about, like, oh, they exclaimed, or they questioned, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, Patrick said, but I'm stuck, I can't move. Spongebob peeked in and uh, figured out what the problem was. Sure, he did. Uh, you're out of shape, Patrick. Oh, gosh. <laughs> uh, you're out of shape, Patrick. You need exercise. Yeah, this is so, so, like, second-rate writing. Um, I think they were just trying to fit in some hard-to-spell words. I, I don't think any of this actually was attempted to be good writing, per se. It does feel like words like exercise and all this punctuation is just meant to really get you to type letters that you otherwise wouldn't type. Because... Yeah, that's what these kind of class things are for. They're just to get you used to typing uniquely. You know what, I wonder if these little practice courses are actually kind of like the, you know, the lazy dog ran over the, the fox jump, you know, log thing. You know how those, like, sentences that use every letter. I wonder if they're carefully writing these to actually try to use every letter on the keyboard. Um, because that would be a very smart way to get you in practice on, on you know, properly typing everything. They might be doing that, and I might just, you know, I can't, I'd have to, like, <laughs> deep dive and figure out, um, like, what they're doing. Patrick asked, when I can't even leave my house? Here, said Spongebob, handing him a flag. You can exercise your freedom! <laughs> that took a twist. Patrick took the flag and waved it. Hey, I think it's working, Spongebob. You can exercise your... discretion? Wait, okay, I think it's, I think it's working, Spongebob. You can exercise your discretion... I'm not gonna say anything about that, Spongebob. Why is this the most AI, like, generated dialogue I've ever read? And I'm forced to type it back out to the computer. Dude, this was made in 2004. Like, somebody, what, what does this mean? Well, practice your rights. You, you have rights. Apparently not the rights to like free speech or anything, but no, you have the right to wave a flag. I guess is what they're saying. Like, this is this feels like a computer trying to understand what American, like, imperialism is. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything about that, Spongebob, is the most robot word ever. Like, literally, 
literally current chat gpt will say sentences like that like if you're like hey tell me how to like commit a felony and they're like i'm sorry i can't say anything about that sir uh, like patrick is talking like a robot can say a uh, good job patrick keep going no what's actually happening in this dialogue this has gone so off the wall it makes no sense I'm not gonna say anything about that, Swan Job. Good job, Patrick. Keep going. You can exercise your right to vote. <laughs> what? <laughs> it is! This is the most oddly American thing. Uh, this is like is like a PSA in like the 1950s. Like, what's going on? <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything about that. Why is that sentence being complimented by SpongeBob? SpongeBob's like, good job. You have the right to not say. I mean, I guess that is your right, right? Like. Ironically, your Miranda right, your Miranda right is that you have the right to not say anything if you are questioned by law enforcement. Is that what they're saying? Is like Patrick saying, is he sticking it to the man? He's like, I'm not going to talk to the police, SpongeBob. Good job, Patrick. Like, what? What's going on? What's happening? <laughs> Exercise your right to vote. Do they vote in Bikini Bottom to begin with? Oh, gosh. This is, this is great. Okay, sponge files are absolutely the best practice parts. Okay, uh, Spongebob passed him a ballot and Patrick voted. Who do he vote for? Patrick goes out, <laughs> votes. Oh man, Patrick, you, you've got a, you've got a rough, uh, set of candidates. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. If, you, if you're voting in the American politics system, I'm, I'm, ah, oh, I don't get to see the end because I typed so poorly. Keep trying. Oh, do I have to do that again? Okay, well, I might come back to that. I don't know what the last little few sentences said, but like, what? What? Fight for your right to party. Wow. That is very funny. That is very, very funny and very, very, like, not SpongeBob. Oh my gosh. I mean, you know, little kids should be learning about politics because by the time you are in a class that you are learning how to type, is the same time that you're learning about, like, history. And I think learning political history is important. The question is then is when, like, you you should be able to learn both sides of politics in schooling, right? Like, you shouldn't have a school that's, like, teaching you only one side. I'm gonna eat a piece of chocolate because I'm hungry. And none of you can say anything about it. I'm gonna eat a piece of chocolate. What did you miss? Uh, you should literally rewind the last 60 seconds or so because this typing class has had SpongeBob and Patrick talking about their their unalienable rights, and it got very oddly like 1960 chocolate. Yes, I have a little ball of chocolate, a Ferrero chocolate. Um. All right, let's go to uh. Let's Rip go to pants. pants. Mmm. Wait. No, we did this one already. SpongeBob at the Maestro. It was very funny, man. I want to see what the end of it is. I'll start talking aloud uh, once I'm done with this chocolate. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was a hungry boy. All right, <clears throat> so, after I drink some water. Look what I found, SpongeBob called, bringing a violin to the Krusty Krab. Uh, oh gosh, here comes some more, like, robot dialogue. Are you gonna give it to me, SpongeBob, Squidward asked? <laughs> Dude, this is, like, the most, you know, kindergarten-level dialogue ever. Which, sure, it makes sense, like, you don't wanna... No, it doesn't matter what... Why do you have to have it be so darn simple? Unless you're just, again, trying to get a certain word count and you really want to cover every kind of word a regular person would normally type. Then yeah, maybe using simple speech in that way. But the poems didn't use simple speech. The poems were nearly difficult to actually understand and comprehend because they were using actually advanced speech. So I don't know why these are so simple in comparison. Um, all right. Uh, SpongeBob took the violin out and started playing it beautifully. Squidward's jaw dropped to the floor. Hey, yelled a fish from across the room. Oh gosh, okay, what's gonna happen next? I don't know, I have to start typing to find out more of this wonderful story. Maybe I can start spamming in a second. Here, I'm just gonna spam. Whee! And I'll start typing correctly. Uh, uh, <clears throat> hey, I run the Bikini Bottom Symphony. Okay. 
<laughs> Dude's just getting a nice uh, McDonald's meal over here, getting a Krabby Patty. And uh, <laughs> here's this dude just go crazy. Would you, could you imagine somebody who, who, who runs the symphony? Like, do you actually hire the musicians or do you actually like communicate with bands? I don't know how, sorry about that. I don't know how somebody who runs a symphony actually has control over like, do you want to join us? There's an orchestra. Like if you ran an orchestra, I guess, who runs the orchestra? Is a composer also like the, like the director? Like, do composers, or are there also, like, music directors as well, who, like, actually organize everything and, like, pay for people's, like, transportation and instruments and stuff? I feel like musicians might have to pay for their own instruments, but, like, if they're transported, they're probably organized by some sort of director of some sort. I don't know. Have you guys ever been in the symphony? Tell me. Uh, my, wife, my wife literally does, she has done music in high school. I don't know how similar that is to, like, the big, big industry of music. I feel like it'd be fairly similar. Um, I don't know why they would do something necessarily different for high school band over, uh, like, official. Outside of, again, financial stuff, maybe. That might be slightly different when you're in, like, literally a symphony. Um, but I feel like it would be pretty similar. Uh, sure, said Spongebob, but Spongebob s or s sputtered Squidward angrily. You just pick up a violin and you're in the symphony! <laughs> Squidward was so angry that he was shaking and his eyes began to twitch. Yeah, fair enough. That was less interesting as... as the absolute, like, crazy, hilariously political, like, you have your rights as an American citizen, Patrick. A sharp-dressed man. man. SpongeBob picked up a package on his doorstep and tore it open. Light poured out of the box and danced on SpongeBob's face. I got an, I got one of the Fs correct. Um, it was his new glitter tie. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> SpongeBob's going out for a night on the town. <laughs> Why are they capitalizing glitter tie? Is this a brand name? Careful, everybody. Make sure you correctly capitalize the brand name Glitter Tie. He decided to show it off. Uh, <laughs> this is starting to actually mildly sound like an episode of SpongeBob. Like I could see him being like, "Oh yeah, let's go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show everybody out." And, and the episode just kind of goes back and forth with him like being disappointed because everybody doesn't care or something. Uh, he went for a walk and everyone called to him and pointed at him. Uh-oh, he's gonna be made fun of. We're learning a lesson today, everybody. Today's lesson is a moral of how to be an absolute nerd. Uh, the driver was so fascinated. Uh-oh, uh oh, 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 he hit another boat. Okay, wait, maybe it's not. Maybe people aren't pointing. People are pointing because it's actually so amazing. SpongeBob is a fashion icon, apparently. Uh, all he had to do is buy the, uh, hashtag, <laughs> hashtag trademark glitter tie. Everybody go out today. The moral of the story is buy more glitter tie. This is just a giant advertisement for, uh, for big tie company. Uh, Spongebob was proud <laughs> that he was causing such a commotion. Uh, sir, he was soon. All Bikini Bottom was in the hospital, okay? This, this, this is starting to sound like when you're in a class, like a, like a creative writing class in like elementary school. Like, okay kids, you can write your own creative stories and I'll I'll make sure as long as your punctuation is good, you can write anything you want to and I'll grade your your stuff. And this sounds legitimately like what an elementary school kid would be like, I wanna, I wanna write a story about SpongeBob and he got glitter ties and, and all the people saw it and, and the world started going crazy and they, they got so distracted by his tie and Gary suggested to SpongeBob that his tie was a bit too much. Like, this is exactly what a, like, you know, a fifth grader would write, right? This sounds like like fanfic. This is hilarious, man. I've got like when I was a kid, I had my little SpongeBob comic books I drew. I've showed you guys multiple times on the live stream my SpongeBob comic books, and this is the exact kind of story that like a kid at that age would write. It's really funny. And SpongeBob agreed, putting the tie away so it could do no more harm. Keep on practicing. All right, come on. That was funny. That was very very funny. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> he's absolutely a supermodel. He's a fashion icon, man. We should all look up to him. We should. All, I mean, I strive to live a life where my clothing causes car accidents. If you're if you're not doing that, you're not doing life right. All right, squeaky Squeak, boots. Squeaky boots. All right, let's just. Mr. Krabs could not pass up an opportunity to make money. We're just gonna be retelling an episode of SpongeBob right now. Uh, one day. Is that my life bar on the side? Like, if I. Trick SpongeBob into buying an old pair of yeah. So this is my life bar. The better I do, the more that that little chocolate bar on the end of the screen, it goes back up. So 
So I can kind of use that as a health bar and just misses crabs. Uh, so here, I'm actually starting to ironically get better at typing the word SpongeBob. I was not expecting to actually learn better typing skills while doing this. I probably should have expected that. But I never like practice in my real life typing the second B capitalized in the word SpongeBob. I always just kind of ignore that and type it the wrong way. Hilariously, this game is making me type the word SpongeBob better. So I guess I'm actually learning today. Who would have known? The learning company has made me learn. Uh, there are fry cooks. So I put bogus boots and happily put them right on away. Squeaky squeak, squeak up boots over the floor with Krusty Krab, reminding Krabs that he had picked Corp Try Krubble. again. Yes. I know you'll do better next uh, I'm gonna time. skip that one because it's basically the story of an episode we've all already seen. Spe special delivery. Um, okay. The Krusty Krab is now delivering... Wait, what? Yeah, wait. So this is just gonna be the episode where it's the... Phone started ringing, a feeling of voice boomed on the receiver. Hello, I'm an or- <laughs> Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> the Krusty Krab is now delivering food. It's going to groan loudly. The phone started ringing, and a familiar voice... A, a familiar voice as in, like, um... Plankton? I assume is where the story is going. Uh, hello! I am an ordinary fish citizen. Yeah, this is definitely Plankton. Uh, and I like a Krabby Patty deliver. We're just gonna deliver it to just to the straight up John Bucket. Uh, deliver to my home. Uh, okay, so he's gonna give an address and they're gonna find out that it's the John Bucket. That's my guess. This has got to be the plot twist. There's nowhere else that they're gonna be going with that. Okay. That's not how you spell okay. Okay. I'll be right there. Squidward tennis balls. Uh, side Squidward. Alright, boop, boop, boop. Then Squidward knocked on the door. Uh, a <laughs> when Squidward knocked on the door, uh, a bucket on the end of a broom answered it. A bucket on the end of a broom answered. What does that mean? Hey, cried Squidward. Uh, what? I'm so confused. I know who you are. You're Plankton. Drat, said Plankton. Why is it a bucket on the end of a broom? A bucket on the end of a broom. Is this something that he did in an episode of Spongebob? So, like, what, did he paint, like, a face on a bucket? The music's really nice in the background. Like, unironically, really nice, relaxing, and not too repetitive music. Granted, I've been talking over it really loudly, so maybe I just haven't carefully been listening to it. But, like... For a typing game, pretty good music. Well, will you at least give me a packet of ketchup, he thundered? Sure, said Squidward, <laughs> dropping it on the floor, probably. Keep on right. practicing. Come. I spam, and then I ruin it. Um, sort of not even that story, no. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that was a pretty straightforward story. Plankton orders a Krabby Patty, and it doesn't work out. Nice. You squeeze jelly. Ew. You squeeze jelly. Why? Wait, 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 wait. You're telling me to type the letter U? Uh, don't mind me. I'll, I'll go ahead and happily do the shortcut typing. I'll, I'll do that. <laughs> wait, let's just type this the way it was meant to be typed. Uh, they were out of jellyfish jelly. Uh, no, no, no. Sorry, sorry, sorry. At the Krusty Krab. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Gotta type it in, in text type. That's what the, that's what this story is meant to be typed in. Uh, it's okay. Oh my goodness, I can't type it worth anything. Mr. Krabs. Okay, said SpongeBob. Uh, SpongeBob ran outside, grabbed jellyfish, and squeezed some jelly out. Say, SpongeBob, to Mr. Krabs. How did that? So that cost you? Uh oh. Uh oh. It was free. Uh oh. Mr. Krabs is it gonna become a jellyfish uh, strangler. This this is kind of the plot of the episode of Jellyfish Jelly. That seems like what they're we're basing this off of. How much did that cost you? Uh, not a thing. Uh-oh, here we go. Not a thing, Mr. Krabs. Uh, I'm singing the song because it takes me too long to type the words, so I've got to sing it just to make it actually last that long. And I'm also going to look at chat because I haven't looked at chat in like 10 minutes. Uh, anyways. 
He has loads of merchandise and movies. Whoa, he's a supermodel now. Can I see them? SpongeBob's got that drip. That good. I used to type the word SpongeBob. Yeah, I mean, oh, SpongeBob. That's funny. When I was little, I thought it was a Krusty Krab pizza. Yeah, I thought that's where the story was going as well. It's not even his story. I actually was playing this game and smashed your keyboard and said my computer broke. That's funny. This is animal abuse. Yes, and we are getting we're getting to that part of the story. Hmm. Uh, said Mr. Krabs. Oof. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. Uh, <laughs> the next day, there was a big banner on the Krusty Krab that said, You squeeze jelly! Jelly fresh from the jellyfish! Wow, what is going on? Is is it, like, canonical that Mr. Krabs just can't, like, write signs better? You sque- Oh, can I just put the caps lock on? You squeeze jelly- There we go. Oh, that's the way to do it. Jelly fresh from the jellyfish. Only 12. Why is the dollars not capitalized? Dollars, they were trying to trick you. Uh, the Krusty Krab was filled with jellyfish, but Mr. Krabs had forgotten. Uh-oh, uh-oh, they forgot the jellyfish sting, probably. I don't know. This is like the most minimal storytelling. I, I want to get back to the politics one. That was really, really funny. Uh, the jellyfish is saying, ow, 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 ow. Try one yeah. more time. Just All right. So we've got, what's that sound? Is Money grip. Money grip. What's that sound? What's that sound? Fight for your right to party. I want to see the end. I feel like we were only one sentence away from the ending of the fight for your right to party. Money grip. We'll go back to that maybe at the end of the stream. Money grip. Uh, he was counting his money when a nickel fell and rolled into a little hole in the wall. Mr. Grabs darted over and grabbed the nickel, but found that his claw is now stuck in the wall. Okay, so this is very much basing it off of regular episode. Um... Sponge Bob walked in. He took a stick and started prying, okay? And tried prying Mr. Krabs out. Oh gosh, I so am failing at typing right now. That didn't work! Okay, this is just gonna be a very simple story of like, oh, he tried this, he tried this. I w there's probably gonna be a punchline of whatever the third thing SpongeBob tries is like a funny thing and then that works. Um, he applied some grease. He was still stuck. Ultrasonic waves, said Mr. Krabs. Okay. Um, uh, sure, Mr. Krabs, we can try some ultrasonic waves. Wow. Uh, that didn't work either. Hey, look, Mr. Krabs. Okay, so what's gonna happen now? I, I'm afraid of, like, typing any spam right now because I spammed all the start of this and now I feel like I am stuck with having to actually do it correctly if we're gonna hear the end of this story. Uh, said Mr. Krabs, uh, that, you know what I need? I need to have a bit of recording of myself just pretending to be, like, really focused on this. So, I'm just gonna, like, be super silent. I'm just gonna be, like, really, like, spam. Here we go. This is, like, this is, like, speedrunner strategy. Here we go. It's speedrun time. <laughs> oh, gosh. <sighs> okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Record time, everybody. Record time. Ah! Competitive paper. <laughs> All right, was that good? Was that a good bit? I feel like that was the worst bit, and it wasn't funny. But whatever, I tried. Uh, look, Mr. Krabs, pointing at the floor. A quarter. Oh my gosh, Mr. Krabs dropped the nickel and pulled his arm out of the wall and grabbed the quarter. Keep on All right. practicing. Punchline is a... he doesn't care about the nickel because he found a quarter instead. Yay. What's that sound? What's that sound? What's that sound? All right, my arm is actually getting tired of typing. Like you know, you get like like that muscle like s tension there. Uh, what's that sound? SpongeBob typing speedrunning game is insane. <laughs> Can we all agree? Typing programs were just pointless. No, I don't think they were pointless. I think they legitimately were good in teaching kids how to type. They're, they're pointless for me to play. Uh, and they're pointless as like a game for f the sake of fun. But um, I think they're very important. Even today when most people are still on mobile, I, I think that typing is, is big and being able to type quickly is huge. Like I only get to type as well as I do because I've learned the correct way to do it. Like I am, I think only doing the incorrect method for uh, maybe like eight, eight of these buttons on the keyboard, which is kind of a big portion maybe, but but that at maximum eight buttons. It's probably more like four um, that I'm using the wrong button for. Now that's one that was very interesting. Wait, how did they want me to do that? 
Yeah, they want me to do shift and use my pinky, which would be way, way f more smart. You know how I type the quote? I put my pinky on shift and then put my ring finger on on that quote button. That's kind of funny. But that works better for me. Actually, no, I don't. I put my ring finger on shift. I put my middle finger on quote. Gosh, dude, it's really weird. Like, sure, if I learned it a little bit better, it would have been nice. And maybe that's a portion of what you mean of like, oh yeah, it's kind of pointless. Is that if you find your own natural way, you'll eventually get good at that and you'll just type well. But I feel like you can at maximum type better if you started learning it the right way. And also, having fun way to, to learn is always better than having to do it the boring way. All right. The play at the kazoo broke. It's okay, SpongeBob said Sandy in tears. Or go, oh, golly, in tears. We're going to the surface to find Sandy Kazoo, Patrick, um, said SpongeBob, pounding his fist in his hand. Uh, at the surface, SpongeBob and Patrick uh, tried to breathe. Patrick, what's this story called again? So they've broken her kazoo, and now they're gonna go to the surface to try to get a kazoo because I guess kazoos don't exist in Bikini Bottom. And maybe it's not a bright idea to actually bring a surface kazoo underwater and try to play a wind instrument underwater. How does the clarinet work, exactly? Now that I think about it. I know it's Spongebob logic and it's not really supposed to make sense, but, like, obviously... <laughs> Patrick! Um, but, like, it's a wind instrument. You're supposed to blow air through. How does the clarinet work underwater? Ah, it's questionable, isn't it? <laughs> um, this game is a mix of something street and Simpsons. If only I could see that first word. If only, if only you, uh, YouTube's system wasn't so bad with a little emoji on there. Uh, I can't find any kazoos. Just grab stuff, said Patrick back in Bikini Bottom. They looked over their loot. Uh oh, they just grabbed random things. It's gonna be like some shells and stuff. All right. Gosh. This, this story is not as captivating as the crazy weird politic one. All right. And Patrick back in bikini bottom. They looked with a little, let's see. A gum wrapper, a sandal, a life preserver, and a glass. Great. Uh-oh. Looked over their loot. Wonderful. Let's see. A gum wrapper. A sandal. Man, typing, isn't it the fun? Isn't this the best live stream you guys have ever watched? And a glass. Oh, Patrick, none of this stuff is any good. Hey, guys, said Sandy, coming up behind them. Uh, all right, a glass. Oh, gosh, this is, again, very low-level writing. Uh, any good. Hey, guys. Dude, I wish I typed scripts this fast. <laughs> uh, coming up behind them. All right, a glass. You want to see a good trick? Sandy ran her finger around the edge of the glass. No, you're not going to do the sound trick underwater. Okay, so everything's about an instrument right now, and the whole story is just, oh, you don't need a, you don't need a kazoo. You could just have a glass. You can't even do that if you don't wet the top. Like, that doesn't make any noise. But if you wet the top... I mean, I don't know how you, I don't know how you actually play a glass. I, I think you're supposed. Maybe you don't use a finger. No, you, people use a finger. I don't know how you play the glass. Um, but making a beautiful ringing sound. And the moral of the story is, Patrick excited grabbed the glass. Oh, that's a long story. It's a long story for a typing game. Uh. There's so much uh, secret SpongeBob lore we never knew existed. All these are all these are canon, by the way. Every single bit of this is all canon events. Um, Patrick excited, grabbed the glass, shattering it. Oh no, not again! Said SpongeBob. Is that the end of the story? Try again. I know you'll do better next time. Okay, <laughs> great. Uh, we'll go back to fight for your right to your party later. Let's now, I think, jump into the tournament. We could check out the mini games. Oi, meaties! Welcome to the activities menu. Pick any activity to sharpen your typing skills. And okay. the best part, it's free. <laughs> that sounds like Homer Simpson, man. That sounds like Homer Simpson doing an imitation of Mr. Krabs. 
That is, that is not good. Strap on your helmets and get ready to race. Okay. Wait, was it? A so what are these? These are three different games, get and there's. Musical. Check out Do Re Mi. Okay, he's just randomly saying stuff. Do Re Mi is the musical. That's the race. Quick, go to Senseless Patrick. He needs your help. Whoa, Patrick lost his senses. Luckily, Mermaid Man's belt shrunk me down, so I can run around inside Patrick's head okay. and find them all. So we're gonna type this really quickly. Shows how much time you have left to complete your lesson. Oh, hurry up! Oh, my hearing's back. Oh, say that word that I like. Uh, uh flotsam and jetsam. This music is wild. <laughs> Stop the tickles. Okay. Um, how are we this small? How do we get inside of here? Dude, this is really tough to just like randomly hit random letters. I'm used to like typing them in an order that just makes hang sense. Hang on, buddy. Okay. D G V K. Oh, right, I can uh, breathe F, again. X Z Do you see it say breathe again? N G T. Now that my taste F. is back, I can go get some delicious Krabby Patties. These are really funny lines of dialogue. All right, buddy. Okay. You got all your senses back. Oh, his senses. So he was. Okay. So he was just fully. Uh, I feel like there's a medical term for that, but he just had absolutely no sense at all. Like he couldn't. All of his senses were gone. We saved him. We saved him by running through his brain. We saved him. Um, who is this great value, Mr. Krabs? Ah. Uh. <laughs> you messed that up. Looks like I need that SpongeBob typing game. <laughs> yes, you all, you all need to play this game. All of you need to get better at typing. Try any activity you want. Okay. They're all good. So, are they all good, Mr. Krabs? Or are you even Mr. Krabs? Strap on your helmets and get ready to race. Well, here we are, typing, oh, okay. buddy. The faster and more accurately you type, the faster we go. Okay, let's go. Just be careful. I can do this. Remember all of the lessons I've given you. I'm great at driving. Let's go. So my typing skills will help me in this. Possible. Quite the service. Don't. What was that? I can't even look up there. Oh gosh. No. Later, Squidward. Diversity for something. Also make. Oh no. Center car some oh no. I, I just don't know how to spell some of these words. Known their minutes age road. Okay. So oh, I can do this. I can do this. It's a race. It's a race. What's a good word per minute? Bye, I, I. Squidward, I won. Can somebody type like quickly Google because I have no screens, my phone is chat, and my one screen available to me is, is currently the game. Can any of you just like Google for me what the average words per minute are and like what the world record words, words per minute are like and then what like a good words per minute is. Like I, I have no idea how to like know if this is good or not and they're not giving me, they gave me a gold medal I guess, I don't know. We'll come back. Try a gold medal for a kid's typing game. Your typing skills. It's Isn't that great? In a race against slime biscuit. It's a snail's pace. Slime race. biscuit instead Welcome of sea biscuit. Snail's pace race. That slime biscuit has been talking a lot of trash about beating Gary. That's okay. why you have to type as quickly and as correctly as possible, okay. so we can take that slime biscuit down. See this counter? It's the words per minute counter. See this counter? It tells you how fast you're going. More is better. Oh, you are good. Thanks, SpongeBob. Sheesh! <laughs> he got shot! <laughs> oh, it's just random gibberish, isn't it? Okay. Ibble, Ibble, Alley. I think Slime Biscuit is an eight, eyeball ahead. Eight, you need, it's Slime you need Biscuit S by an eyeball. S nami, 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 in. Okay, what am I doing? As, as, Tiate, Tiate. In, in. I'm gonna go home and watch paint dry. Ship, ship, burp, burp. 
Am I good? Am I done? Okay. Your typing is saved today. SpongeBob sounds like he's like an entire like courtyard away. What's going on? Welcome back. Try any of the activities to it's time for fashion oh. and a star is We're going to get through these pretty quickly, aren't we? <laughs> Call him me cuckoo. Dress Patrick in a surprise outfit by typing the words on his house. Type three matching colored words to pick a piece of his outfit. Did someone say fabulous? Each color represents a different look for Patrick. Do all the same colors for a coordinated fashion statement or mix and match. Okay. We're getting close. <laughs> Almost there. I'm the special. We're getting closer. <laughs> Hot plate, baby. We're getting closer. <laughs> Almost there. He is good. I'm the special of the day. We're getting closer. I can't wait to. <laughs> Almost. Well, kiss my secrets. <laughs> Just a few more words, and Patrick will have some new clothes. Ooh la la! If you type one more word. Patrick will get ding, 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 ding. Good for you, he looks very stylish. Alright everybody. Uh somebody's gonna use that as their new profile picture, I'm no doubt. <laughs> uh cool? I want to hear the voice acting. I'm going to go a little bit slower so we can hear the voice acting because I kind of skipped through it. You didn't realize I was a master at typing? I've been doing it for over a decade. Alright, let's go with yellow. Almost there. He is going to look très magnifique. Très magnifique. <laughs> what? Sorry, I'm just eating so much chocolate right now. Um, <laughs> it tastes too good. We're getting closer. I can't wait to see what. <laughs> Almost there. He is going to look play magnifique. All right. I know karate. That's such a hilarious line. We're getting closer. Uh, now they're all the same. <laughs> Almost there. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> we are getting closer. I can't wait to see what. <laughs> Almost there. Oh yeah, let's rock and roll. <laughs> oh, oh wait, are these voice lines specifically for the yellow? And it's gonna be a. Uh, Type two uh, more words. Darn it! What's his name? Patrick up. What's what's he? Ooh la la! If you type one more word, Pat Elvis. Yeah, he was doing Elvis lines. That was funny. Oh, they have different music. Great job. I was worried Patrick was getting cold without his clothes. Okay. I, I... Oh, call him me cuckoo. Dress Patrick in a surprise outfit. Okay. By type. Well, this looks like it's just gonna be a sandy outfit. <laughs> On... mm. oh, I didn't closer. get to hear him. I can't wait to see what. <laughs> On... Does this make me look fat? We are getting close. <laughs> On... Let's go surfing now. Okay. We are getting closer. <laughs> On those. Does this make me look fat? Same line. Just a few more words, and Patrick will have. Ooh la la. Oh, it's not Sandy. That's funny. It's actually like surfing, so that'll have to do with that. Okay. Why are the why is the bra so low Great on his job. stomach? I was. I know they had to fit in the lay. Cold without his clothes. But that's like on his tummy. Like that is such that's that's a really bad piece of art. That is really bad. Welcome to a star okay. is I haven't done blue and I haven't done I red. Didn't know Patrick was such a good dresser. We are getting close. <laughs> Almost there. Crash. I am out of this world. I'm out of this getting world. Close, L. <laughs> Almost. Would you care to share a kelp cola? He's just gonna be a nerd. This is all it's gonna be. Close, L. <laughs> Tilda. Would you care to share a kelp cola? 
No, it's the same line. We are getting closer. <laughs> oh, look, it's actually Almost Patrick's there. normal color. Going to look I like comfort and style. <laughs> Just a few more words and do not stop now. Type one more word to dress Patrick up. Okay. Nice. Oh, that hair is so weird. It's very 90s style. Good for you. He looks very stylish. No, he doesn't. He doesn't look very stylish. Steve Urkel, yes. Welcome to a star all right, is born. let's check out Bloop. And then I'm going to probably do one where we combine it all together. I can't wait to Ooh, see I thought it was... I, I misread like. that. I thought it said we wearing. It's wearying? <laughs> Almost there. He is going to look... No, like I don't feet. want to be that one. Four score and I'm handsome. We are getting closer. I can't wait to. <laughs> Almost there. Four score and I'm handsome. We are getting closer. I can't. <laughs> oh. Call the Senate into session. <laughs> okay, these are great. These are the, probably the best ones of this minigame. We are getting closer. <laughs> this is the, this is the voice there. that Patrick was using in that political be. story. Magnifique. I feel like signing a proclamation. <laughs> Just a few more words and uh, do not stop now. Type one. There we go. Look at him. So regal. Great job. I was worried Patrick was getting cold without his clothes. I'm certain he was. Okay, let's do one last time and then Welcome we'll just we'll just I'm gonna a bunch of random ones. I don't even know. I'm just gonna close L. I can't shoot. Wait I can see. type right there. <laughs> Almost would you care to We are getting close L. <laughs> Almost there. He is I'm the special of the day. We are getting close L. <laughs> Almost there. I feel like signing up. We are getting close L. Swatch. <laughs> what a word. <laughs> Almost there. Thank you. Thank you very much. Come on. Oh my gosh. T-E-S. Two more words. Do not stop now. Okay, we just uh, made like an actual is, hippie. You are that is like, that is like, why does that all cohesively work together? Why does that cohesively go together? That is hilarious. We have the nerd. We have the, the, um... The, the waitress, then we have the royalty, or not the royalty, royalty, no, we have the, the founding father, I think it's still founding father's sleeves, we have the, uh, um, the, we have one of everything here, and then we have the, the surfer, that is hilarious, hippie and titanic, yeah, <laughs> titanic hippie, yeah, uh, that is hilarious. That worked out really well. Uh, okay, cool. We're gonna end that. Come on, pick an activity. It'll improve you. Then you'll be worth more. <laughs> Get musical. Check out Do Re Mi. Okay. Welcome to Do Re Mi. Choose a melody in SpongeBob's jukebox, then play that melody by typing letters that appear on the bubbles. Try to type as quickly and as carefully as possible. Okay. Good luck. Oh, that was such a bad. And you'll be bringing it around town. It was such a bad Mr. Krabs laugh. It was such a bad Mr. Krabs laugh. Oh my goodness. Okay, what are we doing? Fishy love. Out of my rock. Hook, line, and sinker. What a catch. Okay. Are this spelling anything? Well, I'll be. Okay, guitar here is a little bit different than I remember it, guys. Golly, this is how it actually sounds when I really play the guitar. Yeah. Is it the same every time? Like, can you memorize that and just like do it really I fast? I feel you could use some more practice. Uh, no offense. Do you play any instruments? Well, you do now. Just type the text you see to hear a melody. It's all happening here in Do Re Mi. Okay. Fishy love. Fishy love. What's this gonna be? B. 
I think I've completely lost the tone. I, like, I, I physically feel tone deaf right now. These all sound the same. There we go. Shiver me timbers! That's the song we were playing? Okay! Okay, goodbye! What are these? These, these are still three mo oh. more. Oh, these are the difficulty settings? Strap on your helmet what was I set to? to Alright, what's one that I can do that's like... Let's do this one. On your I, I want to see what difficult is. Well, here we are. Oh, yeah. I still haven't been able to see what that little graphic is for the guy who does the voice. I'm, see you I'm, later, just, I'm focusing on a very small portion of my screen right now, so I don't really get the chance to see the funny little graphics they put in there. Come on, do it better, Jonathan. You can do this. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it's Squidward. Hi. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm doing really poorly. I put it on hard mode, guys. That's why I'm doing so bad. I put it on hard mode. How'd I do? Ah, that's an okay words per minute. Yes! Yeah, Alright, let's go play the actual competition now. We've done everything but the tournament, which means that once we're done with the tournament, we're gonna be done with the game. And so that's gonna be pretty much the live stream after that's done. I wanna really quickly look up uh, words per minute though. Average to enter the tournament, words click on per the minute. Crusty crab. So most people type around 40 words per minute, it seems. Although, no, it actually doesn't look like that. Um, to hone your skills, click on the practice area. 40 to 50. So 50 is like the most average words per minute. I'm kind of below average right now. It seems. 50 is the average. Based on... To check out some fun activities, a lot of things. click on the Glove World billboard. Uh, oh, what in the world? Typing speed in Chorographic. The fastest typing, the fastest English language typist in the world had a peak speed of 216 like words per minute. The screen. Um, the average typing speed. Uh, girls practice typing more often than boys. However, boys generally show better results. To enter the tournament, that sounds like crab. sexist data. I don't know about that. What does that mean? How do you even know that girls practice more often? What? To hone your skills, click on the practice area. That's a weird, that's weird. But they're saying 44, where, where is it getting this like data from? Young people under 18 made it the largest activities. age group Click of all typing Glove students? World, okay. So, anyways... I don't know. I guess I'm doing good. Welcome to the first annual Bikini Bottom Typing see chat. Tournament live from the Krusty Krab! Round one is just about to get underway, but first let's review the fundamentals of safe typing! Ergonomics! Ergonomics? Oh dear. Oh, is this the- oh, so here we're in the actual campaign. We would request that all typists maintain the correct typing posture. If you don't sit properly, you may experience back, arm, or shoulder pain. You might even end up looking like this. To avoid this awful fate, first make sure you are sitting up straight. Place your feet flat on the ground. Put your elbows at your side, and make sure your wrists are correctly positioned over the keyboard. You are now ready to start typing. Okay, and I'm ready. Now ready for the competition to begin. Round one. A Let's go. Minds, SpongeBob versus Patrick. In the brown trunks, weighing in at 98 pounds, when fully wet, the fry cook that is no small when fully wet. comes to trying SpongeBob SquarePants. Huh? Let's go. And in the floral print, the prodigious pentacle of typing power, Patrick Starr. Uh, I'm ready. Oh gosh. I'm ready. He does not have good form. Look at that seating position. I'll have two Krabby Patties and an order of fries.
If you want to start the lesson, just press the space bar, then start typing. Press the A key? Wait, what? What do you mean lesson? I thought this was a competition. Are you actually teaching me now? Just pretend that I'm not here, watching your every move. Okay. I thought this was gonna be cooler. I thought I was saving this for last. Ready for a drill? Here we go. Okay. Hey, Daddy-o. A bit of what? A bit of advice from an old pro. Always try for accuracy rather than speed in the drill lessons. Say... Just think how hard this would be if you were a clam. Okay. Oh, gosh. So we're just we're just spamming, are we? Oh, this get is, discouraged. This is, I remember what these kind of old school games are like. This is going to be a very slow progress where they just slowly introduce more and more letters. I feel like we've done the most interesting things in this game. Because um, I don't think keep there's going. actually a competition. You can do it. The only way to learn this is to do it over and over and over and over. Okay. Oh, for goodness. SpongeBob is too excited. Too excited about... The, okay. Oh, gosh. It's actually kind of difficult to only use these four keys. You're doing it, baby. You're doing it. Thanks, SpongeBob. Good. You did well in that typing lesson. Your actually was 91% and worst minute was 34. That's not that great. But now I'm... we'll play one of my favorite games. Okay. Do, re, me. Oh. Okay. Do you play any instruments? I should have done this from the start. This is this is your like. Well, be. Cool. I'm just like, tr I never just type these four letters. And it's confusing me. <laughs> it was kind of like the Barney theme song. You're right. I made two errors in this lesson. So my adjusted speed was 32 AP. Okay. It's the lesson area. Is it everything you dreamed it would be? No, it really All wasn't. What you have to do to start the lesson is press the space bar. Isn't that great? Yeah. Okay. Cool. I'm pressing the buttons. I'm pressing the buttons. I'm pressing them so fast. It's time for a drill. I think we could use a little warm up. Okay. Oh dear. This is the one thing that's like remembering where exactly everything is. Just pretend that I'm not here. This is the Why part I hated the room? most about typing class. This is the most like useless, boring thing where it's like, Things come to you pretty naturally when you're typing words. You remember where buttons are based on Just like think how words. Hard this would be if you were a clam. But like this is actually so With unnatural. A little more practice, you'll be great. This is harder to do the than typing real words. This is to do it over and over and over and yeah, over. Yeah, yeah. Oh, D K L S. Uh, F, oh my gosh. F J. I might just be getting tired too. J that L. Don't get discouraged. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. L J that L A L S A L L A S. See, that's actually easier. We're getting closer to actual words, and now, now it all makes Practice sense. Makes then I have perfect. to slow down and like focus on every single little symbol that I'm typing. Good job. Now Thanks. we'll play one. Welcome to Dory. Oh my gosh. Well, I'll be. I keep trying to predict where the letters are gonna be, and I keep I'm keep continuously being wrong. Okay, it's actually a good animation of SpongeBob here, compared to all the other animations we've seen so far. What's up, Studio? I'm learning how to type with a SpongeBob game from 2004. How you doing? <laughs> all right. Black glass is If I treat it like actual words, maybe it'll be easier. Las Kalasa, uh, Fuji. Cool. 
That was easier. Here we are in the lesson area. All you have to do to start the lesson is press the space bar. Isn't that great? J I K I. Let's take a drill to practice some more. This is I guys help 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 help. Did you get around to finishing the Yellow Avenger? That's a great question. I don't remember. <laughs> Did we? I guess not. Just pretend. I guess that I need I'm to go back and finish that. Watching your every move. Uh, oh, what? Oh, sis, kick out of little 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 fifth. Just think how hard this would be if you were a clam. Oh, you can stop saying that line at any point. At any point, it would be great. Yeah. With a little more practice, you'll be great. These Thanks. key combinations are going to get easier the more you Saddle! do them. See, once we start getting actual words, it's so much easier to type. I think that this is like the the thing that you shouldn't be teaching kids, don't I don't think. Don't get discouraged. I don't need to know how to type these random, like, password spams. Faddle. <laughs> Faddle is my favorite word. <laughs> um, yeah, I didn't Patrick finish it because I got, like, senses. in a glitched Let's spot. Help get them back. Oh, we can, oh, okay, here Patrick we go. Lost his senses. Yeah, I know how to play this. Luckily. Now that right. my taste is back, I can go get some delicious Krabby Patties. E -L. All right, I'll go back to E, D, e, uh, and then K, I, F, no, 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 I, F, F, I, E, hey, I get it. you're squishy, and then E, I, F, L, A, and then actual words, fed, said, yeah, so this is just going to be a more boring version of everything else that we've done, because we've it's done okay, all the mini games now individually, and now we have to actually, like, unlock letters. <laughs> Guys, this is the best, uh, oh, shoot. Uh, this is this is what gaming was meant to be. When you unlock things in games, What's you're meant to unlock mind? letters on a keyboard. I've come to my senses. Nah, that's a good. Okay. Don't be afraid. This quiz uses words that combine the keys you already know. Cool. Flasks failed. D dislikes sailed. Silfio. With the exception of I before E problems, I'm doing good. Are you ready to review? Look at oh, that. Yes, 70 or are. 57 words per minute. Let's push the envelope. Let's review. Sea sails, seal kiss, failed falls, sake, feel, lead, oak, oh, oh, come on. Uh, like, oh, come on. I'm, I'm screwing up. I'm not here, watching Ideas, your every move. Idle. Oh, no. I, I'm so not used to using my pinky for that button, and it's literally the button that your pinky, like, lays on. Okay, so typing tournament round one. 49 words per minute, which is about what I expected. 92% accuracy, okay. Help SpongeBob Patrick defeat... Print. Come on. Come on, printer. You can do it. It's not going to do it. Also, stock images. Wonderful. Jonathan has mastered <coughs> these keys. Bro, I mastered these a decade ago. I'm like, is it back now? Round two. Okay. Cutscene. SpongeBob versus Gary the Snail. Look at SpongeBob SquarePants. He's preparing for the typing contest of his life. Against his very. Haha, <laughs> this is a traced animation. Gary the Snail. Is Gary oozing with confidence, or is he just oozing? We'll find out. Imagine Pac-Man, dude. That would be insane to play Pac-Man with those controls. Meow. They have a lot of custom art for these close-ups. Well, here we are in the well. Here we are in the lesson area. All right, learning G. Ah, oh, I remember. This is something that is always the next thing that you are taught in these kind of classes is where the like outside keys are. Oh, I just screwed up on where the G button is. All you have to do to start the lesson is right. press the space bar. H G. Isn't that great? Oh, stop, stop. K H. Oh no, I don't like where I don't like where that little punctuation is. Uh, I'm just doing typing now. It's just, just typing. How hard this would be if you were a clam. It was fun when it was mini games, but now it's learning, and I don't like it. Stop. <laughs> Again, give me real words. Don't get discouraged. You'll get it. You just Tips on how to get practice. 15 leeches off of your the only way to learn this is to do it chest. Over and over and uh, over and uh, over. dude. My suggestion is to not have gotten them on in the first place. That is my suggestion. <laughs> oh gosh. 
Don't get discouraged. I, there's more cutscenes, but do I want to unlock them? Do I want to endure more of SpongeBob typing class? Good job. 25 nah, words well, a minute. Do you play any instruments? If I could never hear this song again in my life, I'd be pretty happy. Well, I'll be. <sighs> what do you think the, uh, the fastest typer in the world, how good he'd be at this game? Yay, I did it. Okay. <laughs> flashes. Oh, shoot. Okay, flashes. Flat flags. Oh no, I'm just showing how bad of a typer I am, aren't I? As tall, feel, hail. There we go. That was pretty darn bad. My adjusted speed was 37. Well, here we are in the lesson area. If you want no to more Barty, lesson, okay. Just press no the more Barty. Bar, then start typing. R U R U R F U J E R I U F. R J U. Let's take a drill to practice some more. F R F R. Oh no! Rrr. Zuz. Kuk. Fuzu. Fui. Let's pretend that I'm not here. Yeah, we've hit we've hit all the voice acting now. So we're just gonna keep hearing repeats. The only way to learn this is to do it over and over and over and over. Hug. Lurid. Ease. Rick, what a way That's to spend my Gary evening. Gary beat Slime Biscuit in the snail's pace race. See okay. if you can help oh. Gary beat <laughs> that gunshot is hilarious. All right. Diffuse salad. There you go. 56 words per minute. I'm on a roll. Granted, I'm going that fast with only half of the keyboard buttons, right? Like, I can go really fast when I don't know that I'm not going to be pressing certain buttons. Isles, dual, jellies, gulf, ales, cages. It's kind of weird if you being want limited to, start to certain lesson, parts of the keyboard. Just press the space bar, uh, then, then start y, typing. J, Y, T, F, T, Y, J, Y. I, I feel like I am going to be subtly better at typing after today's stream. Um... Against my will, I feel. I, <laughs> I feel I am. I am being forced. I promise. I'm getting so much like a whiplash back to middle school in that I feel like I'm being forced to learn just like middle school typing class was. The mini games were always more fun than the actual just lessons. Just pretend that I'm not oh, here gosh. watching your every move. F G uh, J Y and then J and then H and then R, and then U, and then T, and then H, and then Y, and then you follow the same symbols over and over Just until you die. You it never clown. ends, you continue typing. Ah! <laughs> All right, come on, gibberish is very difficult. Legitimately, it is so much harder to type Don't gibberish. Get discouraged. I accidentally typed in the right letter there. Uh, I'm losing my mind. A lo local live streamer loses his mind typing in his typing it's like blowing game. bubbles. You gotta keep practicing. You're about to break through. You're gonna be so proud. I'm proud. Thanks, Tom Kenny. You're, you're great. Let's practice the T and Y by linking them in different ways. Flake. Uh, All right, listen. I don't care how hard practice you try a video game. Perfect. I'm gonna look at the keyboard from time to time. You can do your best. I'm gonna look at the keyboard. Like, you can't. You can't fix that. You can't fix it. It's it's. I'm stuck. Okay. You're doing it, baby. Giddy. Good job. Let's go for. A well, here we are. Here we go. Three, two, one. Blue. Sluggish. Details. Has. You it's so much easier to type actual words. Look at that. Seventy-five words per minute with a perfect score. All right. Your typing has saved the day. When it's real words, it makes more sense. I hate that cheering sound so much. It irritates me a lot more than the one that the snacks talked about. Uh, the Swedish chef. <laughs> uh, flurry, hateful. Listen, guys, I just want to unlock the rest of my keyboard so I can, like, do my Googles, please. How, when do I get to unlock all of my keyboard? Actually, you know what my least favorite thing was? And I don't know if this uh, Let's push game is going to... Let's Sorry. Review. I don't know if this game is going to cover it. Ready to review? But one thing oh, I never yes, was good at are. is using the nine uh, grid... 
uh, typing area for the numbers. I never learned how to do that without looking. I have to like look down and like carefully Just um, pretend do that, that I'm not here watching your every so, move. So that's one thing I don't know this game is going to cover because it doesn't seem like it is. There's no graphic for that, it seems. Unless it's in the DLC. We got to get the expansion pack for this game and uh, unlock typing on the number pad. Just if you were a clam. Um, all right. I just want to see like one more cutscene. I, I don't know how much farther. We're almost through the keyboard, right? You've unlocked like half of it. Okay, cool. Round three, SpongeBob. We've unlocked half the keyboard. Crabs. Will SpongeBob finally make his employer pay? These two competitors have very different training methods. Okay. SpongeBob flips Krabby Patties to bulk up his wrists. That is a tumor. Well, Mr. Crab strengthens his claws by pinching pennies. Let's see if SpongeBob Good job, Tom Kenny. Again. A run for his money. You better it's believe it. Money? Well, it's the lesson. All right, area. let's learn some stuff. Is it everything you dreamed it would be? Yeah, it's everything All I dreamed it would be. All you have to do to start the lesson eh, is press eh, the space eh, bar. Eh, Isn't that eh. great? You're still telling me how to start it, and I started it like already. Sorry, Betty. Sorry, buddy. I'm already in. P Q P W. Ready for a drill? Yeah, let's do it. Here oh we go. Gosh. Cool. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, t oh, I missed one by accident. Okay. Uh, don't get discouraged. My brother is calling me. Brother, don't you know that I am typing? Hey, bro. How you doing? Practice makes perfect. No, I'm on a live stream right now playing SpongeBob typing class. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty awful. You're doing it, baby. Oh You're boy. <laughs> oh, I will have so much fun. I'll call you back a little bit later. Yeah, dude, dude. Hey, uh, SpongeBob typing class, it's best time. game of the century. I, I can't believe they've accomplished so much. Yes, game of the year edition. <laughs> All right, well, I'll call you back With later. A little more practice. You'll All right. Be great. <laughs> You're about to break through. You're gonna be so proud. Uh, I'm proud. <laughs> I don't know what he wanted. I'll just call him back afterwards. All right, popular guffaw, dude. Guffaw is actually a you good are word. You my hero. And then whatever this is is not a word. And then this is also following it up with not a word. And then this is eatery, which I've also misspelled. And then holy. And then ah. Oh, oh. All right, come on. Let's help get welcome to Snail. Fu <laughs> Futurity? Joyfully setter soars wither. Listen, you guys may laugh at me. I'm over here getting better. I'm increasing my skills. I am streaming a Spawnbar game and I'm increasing my skills. No one no one can, can say anything about me, all right? I am learning. A man who can learn is unstoppable. Guys, I am unstoppable today. It's the lesson area. Is it everything you dreamed vroom, it would vroom, be? Vroom. That's not a if sports car. That's the, the sound lesson, of your next keys. Press the space B, B, M, and N. Start typing. It's pretty funny. All right. B, B, N, M, a B, N, B, 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 M, B. Got it. Go. Gotta get a go. Gotta get to hit the buttons, yo. Just pretend gotta, gotta go. that I'm gotta, not gotta here. Go. Gotta, gotta hit the Drill buttons, yo. Awesome. And then we got you know B, what they say about S, practice. B, A. And then these letters. And then, hey, let's just throw in some spice with it, you know? Like, if you're gonna make a good meal, you just gotta throw in a bunch of letters into it, you know? Like, why write a good paragraph or write a good story? If just you could just make, hard this would be if you can just make, like, uh, you know, <laughs> alphabet soup letters over here, just, ah. I want to get a great grade on my little assignment here. Just aquilum. Forget vowels. Vowels aren't necessary unless you're writing the word Don't vom. Get discouraged. Vom and um are very important uh, vowel words to use. You know, if you don't use those. I don't even know what you're talking about, man. I don't... Uh, <laughs> okay, I feel like if you just, like, fast-forward and rewind throughout this live stream, you just find me slowly losing it as I as I actually start, like, narrating my own insanity. Um, DV... Laman! Laman. Isn't that, like, the name of a race? Like, the, the Laman or something? It's like a French it's like blowing bicycle bubbles. race or something? You keep practicing. The if you don't learn to type, to you won't be able to type your brother's over, phone number to call him. And yes. And over. <laughs> All right. Mend. Vzz. Vassan. 
Mm-sp. Maritime. Oh, that's not how you do it. Maritime. Nylon. Beep. Boom. Patrick has lost his Typing buddy, you deserve to have some fun. Let's play Senseless Whoa. Patrick. No, I don't think this one's actually that fun. This is actually my least favorite of the minigames outside of the music one, so thank you for, for caring about me. But Typing Buddy, uh, I, I don't actually like this minigame. Alright, come on. I can do it. Uh, T A I literally tried to type I tried to go backspace to go backwards, and that's obviously not how that works. Uh uh, oh, I guess that's just like the thoughts that Patrick has. Or it's S G P B, and then in reverse now. Uh, and then J H. Where am I going next? Oh, they split them up so far away. You didn't have to make this mini game more difficult. W F B R. Just hang on, buddy. Uh, must remember. Oh shoot! I pressed the wrong button. Not to touch. Gosh, come on. Really hot stuff. All right, good. I know uh, I can figure this out. Right. Do, 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 do. Yeah, you can figure out SpongeBob. You're doing a great job. Can smell me again. Ew. Very gross. Now that my taste is back, I can go get some delicious Krabby Patties. All right. Why? Deb, you. No, 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 no. Wrong way. Wrong way, SpongeBob. SpongeBob. There we go. All right, buddy. We're almost finished learning the letters on the keyboard. Yay. Now remember typing, buddy. We're still shooting for perfect typing. Don't need to dazzle them with our blinding speed until the intermediate level. What do you mean intermediate level? How much more is there? Freedom talons! We've heard about those! SpongeBob was telling Patrick all about freedom talons! Hart and Moors, Hastings, Leon. If Good you job. want to start the great. lesson, just Z press the space X bar, C then v. start typing. All right, 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 right. Oh, now we're going to M! Whoa, they just threw some spice in there! Whoa, we're getting a lot of letters. We're just, uh, I, th I think we've already learned some of those. All you have to do to start the lesson Oh, I hate these. These the are actually Isn't that great? the least practiced that I have on any characters on the keyboard is where these are. Like, straight up. Oh, gosh. They want me to use the middle finger for that? Okay. Uh, A. No, it's actually. Is, it, is the just middle finger the better one that to do? I'm not here. This is the most awkward. Every move. Uh, come on. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Where is the floating SpongeBob head? Right? Like we need the floating SpongeBob head. Just think how hard this would be if you were a clam. I just... It's like blowing bubbles. You gotta keep practicing. Do we care? The only way to learn this is to do it over and over and over and I over. I don't think I don't think they care that I actually just totally failed that. Alright. Xylophone. Thank you for a real word once in a while. Um it is hilariously difficult to don't forward. get discouraged. And then whatever this is going to be, V, and then that one. <laughs> and then that letter, and then that letter, and then calf. Let's Thanks. Welcome to a star is All right, Pearl. We're getting closer. <laughs> wait a minute. We're getting closer. I can't wait. <laughs> I like comfort. I can just go for all the four letter words, and it's oh, even yeah. easier. We're getting closer. I can't wait to see what happens. <laughs> uh, I thought we were done. He is going to look. Oh, yeah. Let's rock. Just a few more. Do not stop now. <laughs> I almost got all of one. Congratulations. You are a great typist and a stylish person. Hello, Romyblocks. How are you doing? I am both succeeding and failing in this typing game. Punctuation keys, my least favorite. Uh, deceit, chips, infancy. That's a frightening sentence. <laughs> Scant delicate. Mm, Black's pretext. Why did they pluralize that? It's the lesson area. It's a bit questionable. Is it everything you dreamed it would be? All you have to do to try to not look at the keyboard is press the space bar. Isn't that great? Oh gosh, I just want to be done. Give me my final cutscene. Give me my final cutscene and be done. Yeah, I've learned the keyboards. They're gonna make me learn the numbers too, aren't they? Actually, maybe they won't. I haven't seen numbers in this just entire game. Just pretend that I'm not here watching your. Remember, everybody, you never need to type numbers. Who needs to learn to type numbers? Nope, not me. Never. Never. S, J, D. Gosh, at this point, our SpongeBob art should just be me All typing you have to out do like, to start the lesson is like uh, the space bar. uh, what's it called? When you make art out of letters, it's a uh, ASCII art. I should just do ASCII art for uh, oh gosh, S period J comma uh X D X D guys X D. Oh my goodness, this game has run its course, my fellas. 
My fellas, it is it is time. Don't get discouraged. JFC. E S J Z. Do you think these are fully like randomized, or do they think they actually like chose which letters you have to type here? Makes perfect. Okay. Show us some cutscene. I, I was I was doing the right letters. It's not my fault. I was off by a comma or whatever. It's, it's like, I don't know if you guys have ever seen when people do, like, college classes, and they have, like, a college, uh, you know, final test, and you have to type in the number, and if you didn't put enough of the significant, like, figures at the end of it, enough, Come like, of the extra trying. digits, then they totally just, like, fail you on the, on the assignment, and it's you didn't like get it. Bubbles. Either you got the answer right, like, oh, the answer is 0. .25, but you didn't You're type so 0. .250. Proud. I'm proud. Noodles! They love JFC, this is a bit weird. Uh, frogs funny. Uh, I agree. Yes, frogs are funny. Thank you so much for speaking what the people you need to hear. You are my hero. Uh, no, you're my hero. You talked about frogs and being funny, and that's all that matters. And my fingers are really tired, guys. Like, I, my hands are... I'm growing muscles, I guess. I don't type this much. Let's help Gary beat Slime Biscuit. See if you can uh, help Gary. Crackery fidgeted generals lizards! Lounging. Dude, I'm speed running this. This is like what you. Oh, what's up? This is what you would used to do in actual typing classes. Just try to get done with it as quickly as possible. Because when you got done with it, then your teacher would be like, "All right, once you're done with your assignment, as long as you got a good grade on the assignment, then you can go play CoolMathGames.com." And that is what I always did. In typing class, I'd be like, okay, I'm gonna do this as good as Let's possible, as fast as possible. Are you ready and then once I'm done me? with everything, oh, go to Cool yes, Math Games. Alright? Go play the cool little, uh, the physics engine, um, like, driving game, where it's a two-dimensional game, and you're, like, driving a little car. Like, that kind of stuff is, is fantastic. That Just is what, that was the best I'm part. Not here, watching uh, every wasn't there, there was a game called, like, Kick-A-Buddy or something? Where you had, like, had this little buddy, and, uh... Dude, all those classic Flash games are so great, and that's like the time that I would play them. Um, Just think how hard this would be if uh, you were a clam. You know what they had on those computers is they had copies of uh, Plants vs. Zombies. Like, the only time I ever played Plants vs. Zombies in my entire life was in typing class. You got to finish your assignments yeah, early, discouraged. you get to play Plants vs. Zombies. And uh, it's, it's just, that's the classic time, dude. That's the classic time. Run and Run 2. Uh, yes! Bloxers! Yes, dude! Bloxers! Yeah, I love that one. That one was a great one. kick -a buddy was maybe one of my favorites. It was so mindless and, like, aimless. But it was just... It was fun to, little like, push little physics engine guy around. You're doing it, baby! You're doing it! Um, Volt. I didn't go too fast on that one, but, uh... 31 words per minute with an unknown... That's pretty bad. Pretty good, I mean. Yeah, we've gotten everything besides question mark, haven't we? Also, I like how they're not showing these two having anything. They're just not going to teach us how these work, huh? Also, what happened to the caps lock? They couldn't stretch the icon, so they just, like, duplicated it over itself? Where's stuff's going on? Round four! Crawl with the bully! SpongeBob oh, faces go. Flats the Flounder! You could play Super Mario 4? I said SpongeBob faces Flats the Flounder! That's better! <laughs> Don't say it, let me guess. You're gonna kick my butt. Well, this time I came prepared. Ready when you are, flat. <laughs> United <laughs> States, what is with this company? And they just love, they, well, they are all about the United States. in the lesson area. They love it. If you want to start the lesson, it's the lesson area. Is it everything oh, you dreamed it would be? Wait. Oh, no, we're learning capitals now. Space bar. Isn't that great? Is everything capital? Dude, I'm putting caps lock on. You kidding? I'm cheating. I'm cheating. If everything's capital, I'm putting caps lock on. You, you want me to put more effort into this? No, sir. No, sir. I'm not putting more effort into it. Come on, keep trying. Dude, I'm putting the minimum amount of effort All needed. All you have to do to start the lesson is press the space bar. Oh Isn't gosh. That great? Oh gosh. Now I actually have to think about it, Jake. Oh no, this is pain. This is torture. Oh no. No, I hate this. You are my hero. Ah, oh, oh, I hate it. This is bad. L capital L J I. J. Oh my god. Oh, LOL. Uh, no, one key I don't at a like time, it. baby. One key at a time. I'm doing one key at a time, SpongeBob, and I want it to be done with, so I'm doing it as fast as possible. I'll do LOL, and then KPK, 
and then JHJ, and then LUL, dude. Blowing bubbles. Nice. You gotta keep practicing. Uh, wait, did You're it show Mr. Krabs versus SpongeBob last You're round? And so how did Mr. Krabs even type? I'm yeah! Proud. He just. I mean, apparently he practiced by penny pinching, I guess. Pit. No limbs. Harrisburg. Portland. Yeah, I used to make that mistake too. Okay, I didn't even make a mistake, buddy. You could have at least lined up that line of voice acting when I make a mistake. Pacific Nashville! Woo! Just keep trying. You're doing great. Peony job Moscow. Let's, Good job. Well, here we are. Oh, I'm gonna have capitals hey, in this. The faster and more accurately you We got a new background! The faster we go. They gave Just us a dark background here. And remember all of the lessons I've given you. You Let's better believe it. Go. Let's go! Hey. Lighthouse, omit, prospective, muslins, Pytio sleep. Dude, the first car racing one I've done with perfect timing. Perfect typing, I mean. Not a single mess up. Okay. Heliotrope, dude, I am learning. My brain is getting bigger by the moment. I'm not going to be able to fit into my previous hat size, everybody. I don't know what I'm going to do. I shouldn't pat my back too quickly. I want to, like, make a bunch of typos right now. <laughs> right after you brag is the time that you will always mess up. That is true in life well, for everything. Here we are in the lesson area. All you Wait. have to do to start the oh, lesson it's the opposite is side. the space bar. Yeah, they're teaching me right? the opposite side. So I've caps locked it again because I'm a big, fat, lazy man. Um, so we're gonna do that, 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 G, B. Uh, how is he typing on a car? <laughs> it's time for a drill. I think it's, we could use it's a little It's the only up. way to drive, my guy. I, I, I play every driving game like that, all right? I play Forza, and I'm like, I'm just typing letters. Dude, that's how you, that's how you win, all right? The best drivers in every video game. Just pretend that I'm not here watching your every move. They type, move. man. They type. They type. Uh, I'm gonna have like a sore like hands tomorrow. I'm like, why are my hands so sore? I didn't like exercise them or anything. No, I did. I Just did think indeed. How hard this would be if you were a clam. How hard would it be if you were a clam? Here's how hard. Bad. <laughs> All right. Don't get discouraged. You'll get it. You just have to practice. The yeah, only no. way to learn this is to do it over Arizona, and over and over and Chicago, over. Baton, Columbus, Columbus. Declaration uh, is on the dude. I don't care about getting don't a good get grade. Discouraged. I'm not turning this into a teacher. I'm doing it on a live stream. Who needs to have it be good? Come to pass. All right. Let's. Yeah. Call it. Wave. Oh, we're getting close. Swim. Duck. <laughs> sea. We're getting trout. close. Trout. Oh, yeah. Let's. We're getting close. Yacht. On the... Oh, yeah. Let's. Rigs. We're getting close. Bottom. <laughs> so typing slash is driver's edge now? It, it's it's always has been, my guy. It's my secret. Table. Slide. Do more like right. Oh, interesting. What a cool game. You are great typist. Come on, let us see the final cutscene. Let me be done. I've learned typing years ago. I'm good. I'm good. Trust me. I'm good. I don't care. I know I've made mistakes today, but I'm good. I can live with those, okay? We can all live with a slight margin of error. Nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. I think the margin of error is actually very inspiring. It's inspiring to know that I can't type worth anything. <laughs> oh, come on! No, no, that was a very ironic time to really mess that up. <laughs> Pernicious. Dude, it's, it's not just a typing class. This is like... Language class. We're learning. We're learning a bunch of stuff today. Well, here we are in the lesson area. Ah, we finally learned the question the lesson, mark button. Just press the space bar, then start. Oh, we're typing. learning quotes too. Wait, what? Where's that? Oh gosh. Oh, so we are going to use the number keys, just in a way that I'm not very happy about. <laughs> Jay. Oh, just pretend sorry. that oh. I'm not oh. here, watching then, your every move. Colon. Oh, they're going to make me do colon and semicolon. No! I'm done for, chat! I'm done for! They, they, they were using my weakness against Just me. Just think how hard this would be if I don't know the difference. Are made for practice. All right, so colon and is you know shift. What they say about I straight up don't think I have that, like, actually, like, in my brain properly. What is this string of letters? Ha. <sighs> A. Don't get discouraged. Oh, gosh. Dude, I am discouraged, man. I am, I am, I am, I am at my wit's end. And I, I am like, I don't even know how much we've been live streaming. I've only got one screen Practice up. Practice makes perfect. Oh my gosh, okay. Q, exclamation mark. Um, 
Uh, by the way, we're probably gonna have a short live stream on Saturday morning, You're just because excited. life is very You're busy right now for me. The fact that I'm squeezing in as much time as I am for this typing game is kind of wild. Uh, but I want to see all the cutscenes so that we've seen them all and it's done and and just blah, 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 blah. Come on, and keep then trying. boop, Q, boop, and then nope, boop, Q, boop, and then Z, and then question mark, and then Z, and then Q, and then I'm typing letters. Oh, you've been live for two hours? Okay, fair enough. You are my hero. Bit longer than I than I was budgeting for today, but gotta we're gonna finish practicing. the game. The we could have split this into two streams, I guess. Over and over but that would have been a bit much. Oh, here we go. Full punctuation now. Yummy. <laughs> and then exclamation mark K. Uh, what is One this? key at a time, baby. One key no, at a no time. Matter. She asked. Uh, cities. <laughs> that's not the next word. That is not, that's not a cohesive sentence. Uh, we, we've gone full random now. Um, RT. Uh, yeah. When? I used to make that mistake too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, what? Uh, this, dude, this is just the experience of me sitting here and typing and SpongeBob making fun of me for my bad typing skills. That's all this is. Uh, boop, boop, just boop. keep trying. Uh, boop, You're doing boop, great. Boop, boop. All right. Let's great. help. Awesome. See if you can help Gary. Face delightful, dude. Somebody just gets shot every time we start this mini game. Uh, hall like. This is this has become an absolute speed run for me. I just want to like find the end of it. Slime biscuit is an eyeball ahead. It's slime biscuit by an eyeball. He's really not. I don't know why you're saying slime biscuit has anything on me. I am way ahead. This whole typing thing taking place in the Krusty Krab. Wouldn't the type drama take place in <laughs> Squidward's house? <laughs> There's also a Garfield typing game called Garfield's Typing Pal. It better have a cool floating Garfield voiced by Chris Pratt. You've seen a new Spongebob, it's called Plankton and the Beanstalk. You should check it out. I saw some uh, stills of it recently when on the wiki, the Spongebob wiki. Yes, John, speaking of Garfield, it looks like we're gonna have a Garfield strip right in the middle of this typing game. Uh, <laughs> yes, John, yes. D equals. What is this? She, dude, this is like. I feel like I'm going through some sort of weird, like, typing dementia. What is the price of that lamp? Like, I'm time traveling through and I'm like going through the multiverse and just hearing random conversations and it makes no sense and it's all garbled together. Like, what is this is being put so many times. It's so weird. Like, this is what every typing game is like. Push the envelope. Let's review. It was a great day. Oh, we finally get something real. Day in Bikini Bottom. Bright and sunny. Just pretend that I'm not here watching your every move. I didn't give up. What are you talking about? I didn't give up. I wasn't trying to... I'm doing great. Don't tell my, don't tell my teacher. Don't tell my elementary school teacher that I'm doing this bad as a 20, 26 year old. How hard this would be if you were a clam. <laughs> Very hard. I think I'm doing pretty good. I'm just like, first off, two hours? You straight up don't have that much belonging in a typing class. Typing classes in middle school last an hour. I am going above and beyond today. Don't get discouraged. I have never in my life spent this much time practicing typing. This is, I actually am, <laughs> that's kind of funny to think about that in my entire life, there is not a Practice single situation in my entire life where I've played a typing game for this much contiguous amount of time. This is it. This is the biggest time, and I'm never gonna have it again. This is the first. This is the first and last. Like that's it for the rest of my life. This is, we will always know this will be the longest session of typing class that I'll have ever done. That's kind of weird in a cosmic sense. Come on, keep trying. Two hours of typing. Oh my gosh. Well, it's it wasn't quite two hours. Area. It was more like an Is hour. Is it everything now. you dreamed it would be? Are you, you ready, to Eddie, Eddie, lesson, to learn some new keys? No, I want to see a cutscene of me done with the game. D is not a new key. Question mark is not a new key. F is not a new key. That's not a new key either. We've got all these. We've done all of them. S, B. You're just you're just quizzing me now. You are H, my hero. We, yeah. Okay. We've done that. We've done that. We've done that one. We've done that one. We've done that one. You're not. I'm, you're not teaching me anything. You're not teaching me anything. You're not. You're not. You're not. You're bad. You're, you're dumb. You're one dumb and you're bad. Time, baby. One you're dumb and your jokes time. are bad. You're, you don't know how to teach typing. You know what? You're big stinky and Ready you don't know how to teach drill? typing. Here How's that? We go. How's that? 
Uh, you're gonna tell him or her, your teacher, uh, Banana, or secretly Gibby from I Gibby. Nice. You know there's gonna be an yeah. official Splendor restaurant. I, I heard that about that. I, I saw it in a, in a uh, article, and I actually didn't click the article. So what, what is the official Splendor restaurant, and where's it gonna be? Um, like, are they putting it in a theme park, or are they actually gonna Just make it like? Trying. Are they gonna You're make multiple great. of them? Are they going, like, full, odd, like, Monopoly style? Like, ah, Spongebob, we own this brand. Let's just make a franchise of Spongebob restaurants. That would be wild. Imagine going to a local Spongebob restaurant. Really Imagine me. being a high schooler and getting your first job at, like, a local Spongebob restaurant. That would be wild. Uh, the gibberish I hate so much. Ooh, I gotten very Grandma negative. I'm so negative right now. I gotta get more positive. I've got, I've dropped, I've dropped the bar on my positivity today. I'm so sorry. I, I play a little typing game and I get all turnt. I get turnt and bent. I can't do that. No, 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 no. We're gonna be happy now. Look, H. Oh, my favorite lever. Oh, a colon, super. not colon. Oh wait, no, no. It's the other thing. Yeah, no. There's a colon. Nice. Uh, T question mark. I've always asked that question my entire life. Oh, isn't typing the favorite thing in the world? Ah! <laughs> Wait, no, 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 shh. Okay, you know, I think you're getting Recenter better. myself. Recenter, no, find, really. find my typing zen. If you find your typing zen, then you'll actually find the way to, to, to make your way through life, really. If you can't find your typing zen, then who are you, really? It's like blowing bubbles. You really? gotta keep practicing. You're about to break through. <sighs> you're gonna be so proud. I would, I'm dude, I will actually be proud of being done with the game. Uh, retweet. Uh, and then, oh, sorry, it's not called Twitter anymore, my bad. Uh, it's called the worst platform on the internet. That's what it's called. Uh, what? Exclamation mark. Like and then exclamation mark. Gee, I feel like I'm typing Discord, like, um, like, commands for a, a bot. Your aircraft, stop and you, no! No! Oh, don't be sad, you're doing fine. No, this game was made in 2004. They could have carefully not made a reference to that. Not that it's made a reference, obviously, but it is, in our modern day of internet humor, any sort of words like that, don't get sand in your bridges. you immediately Just get, like, going. word association, and then it goes straight to the meme, so, you know. Uh, <laughs> slime biscuit in the snack. See if you can help Gary. <laughs> Seeing chat just go, no! <laughs> Expectancy, hinge, ordinary, silence, stalled, unworthy, accordingly. Can't they say it's like Gary by a mile? Because that's what it actually is. Gary is doing very good. All right. Another quiz. <laughs> Some anime sounds right at the start. And then punctuation that cannot make any human noise whatsoever. Uh, who is using the computer this afternoon? <laughs> Cities. Uh, good. <laughs> Love that answer. She exclaimed. Yeah, no, dude. Th this Are is like a lady a having a conversation oh, yes, with a dying are. computer. Was a great day. No, we're doing the same thing again. They couldn't even give me something new. In bikini. They should use some of the fun. Dude, I so wish. This would be so much more fun right now if they put Just in the, uh, the poems. Here, the poems and the cool little stories. I would so love to be able to get progress in the main story of this game while also doing the actually interesting things to type. But no, they give us the weird boring things, including something that we've done already done Just already. think how hard this would be if you were a clam. Oh, how hard would it be? I don't know. <laughs> Um, uh, Katrina's cooking something and it smells good. It also smells like don't a little bit like popcorn. I don't know if it's popcorn. Um, go to the Goo Lagoon and work on our tans, said Pat. Goblin down. The rest of his ice cream cone. Oh gosh, I'm getting too tired to play a typing game, guys. Of his ice cream cone. Woo, it wasn't bad. 69%. Area. Is it everything you dreamed it um, would be? D oh, come on, dude. When does this game end? We've learned bar. these already. Isn't that great? Like, we've learned it. We've learned it. We're good. We're really good. There's no way to save your progress in the game, is there? Like, if we left the game right now, would you have to it, fully baby. restart? You're doing it! Who's the quality testers for this game? I don't think they did very good. Ready for a drill? Here we go! Do you care? Now what if I just get like these last two correct? There we go. 
Hey, check it out. I got some cracks. It's like blowing bubbles. You gotta keep practicing. These key combinations are going to get easier the more you do them. <laughs> wait, 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 does it not matter? Your accuracy was 0%. Your timing speed is 225 words per minute. You made 90 errors in the lesson, so your adjusted speed was zero Let's help get accuracy. You can help oh, Gary. they're going to let me progress, though. Wait. Oh, no. Okay, this I actually have to do well. Okay. We could just, dude, we're going to, we're going to, I found a cheat code. I found the cheat code. It's, it's called not doing good. I think Slime Biscuit is an eyeball ahead. It's Slime Biscuit by an eyeball. Leghorn. Foghorn Leghorn. Um, polite retract. Good. You know, this game feels like insanity because it's like the same thing over and over, but slightly different each time, playing the same mini games over. Yes. Also, hearing the same Splendor quotes over and over is definitely getting old. 100%. Alright, take another quiz. No! I refuse. Oh, bye bye, chat. I couldn't see you. Okay. That wasn't your best. <laughs> yeah, no, I know it wasn't. My accuracy was six. I got something well, correct. Here we are in the lesson area. If you want to start the lesson, just press the space bar. Does it not end anymore? Typing. Is there gonna be a, like, come on. We started, we've gotta be close. There's gotta be one more cutscene. Imagine if there's not a final cutscene. Like that's it, that's as far as the game was produced. And now it just is an just endless loop. Just pretend that I'm not here watching your every move. I'm gonna just be doing this on an endless loop for an hour. All you have to do to start the lesson is press the space bar. Isn't that great? Lesson chart. Where are we? Oh my gosh. Wait, no. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, well okay. Then I'm really spamming. If, if that's as far as we're going, we're only halfway through the game, yeah. These key combinations are going to get easier the more you do them. Let's welcome to I only have to try here. Because it doesn't let me go forward if I type the wrong one. So this is like four hours of content then. Well, no, it's like three hours. It's a three hour game. Sweet. Symbols? Yeah, no, it's fine. What's the most common letter? If I just like spam E, I'll, I'll actually yeah. get like a good Here percentage. We are in the lesson area. All D you have question to mark. Because if I press random lesson. letters, it's actually more press common than I get a zero Isn't percentage. Right? But if I just spam the same letter, then every time it shows up, I will get points. So that might be a more efficient way to get percentage. Not that the percentage even matters, it seems. It seems like they're just letting me progress. Yes, pretend. No matter what. Here. It's a pretty Watch bad typing game if you move. ask me. It's got a big flaw. All you have to do to start the All right. lesson What's the is ghost common press one? the space bar. Isn't that great? Whoa! I'm so fast! Keep going. You can do it. I don't think that was the These most common. Combinations are going to get All right, what's the most common? The Looks like, uh, I. Maybe it was the letter C. 7%. Let's help. Welcome to Snail. First scene. Countryside elegant. He's not an eyeball ahead! SpongeBob! You're an eyeball behind! You can't see what's going on in this race! I am doing much worse than I've ever done in this minigame, but I am still winning, and I always will win because I mean it's a race of snails. I'm gonna go home and watch paint. Sorry to tell you, but there's two more rounds. It's okay. We've we found our new our new strategy, and our new strategy is spam. All right, you ready to see some typing skills, everybody? I'm gonna do exclamation mark. Look at that speed! Look at that speed! Spun up 323 words per minute. I think I just beat the world record, guys. The world record was only 140. I am literally the fastest typer. If you typer. want to start the lesson, just press the space bar, then start typing. F. Boom. A, boom, S, B, question mark, H, awesome, J, O, O, uh, go, D. Just mark, pretend boom, that I'm boom, not here. Boom. We're getting really close. Okay, come on. Okay. I shouldn't quite. I shouldn't hold shift during that. A, N, F, eh, 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 eh. All you have to do to start the lesson is press the space bar. <sighs> Isn't that great? It's like blowing. I'm bubbles. so good at this game. Keep practicing. <laughs> 
the only way to learn this is to do it over You're only and over basing and this over knowledge off of a walkthrough playlist? There's a walkthrough for this game? I mean, I don't doubt it. There's a walkthrough of every game in existence. Francisco? What is this, she asked. Here. Andrew saw his friend and said hi. Let's help. See if you can help Gary. Alleviation. Artificial. I, I wanted to do a song with it. Automobiles. Composing. Denounced. Gable. Limitations. Prevails. See, I can type well. I don't need spam, but it's definitely getting us through this faster. Okay. How much, how much farther do we have to go? No way. It takes that much time to get through one lesson. The lesson area. Yeah. If you want to start the lesson, just press the space bar, then start typing. I just want to know what the end of the story is. I just gotta find out. You guys want to chat about anything else because this is gonna be the same just thing over pretend and over. That I'm not Literally here. bring up any topic and I'll chat about it. Move. Because this is the game Each for the rest you of the game. Practice a key, you'll get better. How is a computer under the sea? Wouldn't With the whole ocean practice, be like, be yeah, great. yeah, it would be electrocuted entirely. It it, well, the more you do them. I don't think it's supposed to be a computer, right? Because SpongeBob in front of him in the game has a Let's typewriter. Well, so he's just yeah, typing yeah. on like paper is what I think is, is the idea. Um, but there are still computers underground. I mean, Karen is a, sorry, underground, underwater. Karen is an underwater computer after all. Um, I think Slime Biscuit is an eyeball ahead. Yeah. It's, it's ironically a good actual uh, sound effect, like, edit that they have for Spongebob's voice to make it sound like it's through the speakers. Uh, tremendous utilizing. Alright. Oh, he's only to oppose Mrs. Puff, Squidward, Plankton, and Sandy. What? Really? Wow. It's a good thing I'm so good at this game. <laughs> Well, you guys are sad, are Gibby, from, I, What is that, Gibby? You you, is that a thing that, you, that is made up, or the is there actually that um, a thing? All right, what do you guys think? I think we might just go to the Squidward or SpongeBob art. I can't, I can't get over saying Squidward art. I'm this far in, and I'm still saying Squidward just art. Just pretend that I'm not here, watching your every move. But we have played this game officially. We have played the game. Ready for a drill? No one Here can say we haven't we played go. the game. And no one can say I haven't even tried, right? Like, I tried. Practice, you'll be if this great. game wasn't a four-hour game, then I would have just done it fully. The more you do them. Have you seen Disventure Camp? It's a survival Let's code drama Gary inspired anime biscuit. web series. See if you can help I have Gary. not. Yeah, this is like the same three things over and over now. And they want you to continue to do this for like hours. <laughs> Referendum. I think Slime Biscuit is an eyeball ahead. It's Slime Biscuit. When do we get our next cutscene? Can I at least see one more cutscene before we give up? <sighs> Die? Furry? Furry is in my typing game? It makes you start over on lesson 13. Oh, is that what it's doing? Oh, so I actually have to do it good. Well, then we're done. This is a keyboard only activity. <laughs> sure. Okay. Yeah, if it's time, if it's restarting me the entire time, then I've just spent like 20 minutes doing the same thing over and over. Then we're done. Because I'm not going to put effort into it. And. We can maybe watch like a YouTube video that shows all the rest of the cutscenes. That's probably what we're gonna do. <laughs> do you really, really, really want to quit? That's okay. I forgive you. Thanks, SpongeBob. Okay. Uninstall. <laughs> um. Hi there. To sign in. So, can we see what the end of that political story was? That's all I care about anymore. Fight, fight for your right to party. Right to fight for your fight for your right to party. All right, let's try it. Let's let's figure out what the end of the story is. Yep, the kitty has jumped into my lap and now she's hanging out. SpongeBob went to see Patrick one day. 
Patrick! He called. Boo -boo -boo -boo. Gosh, just, just, just do the game. Just do the game. I'm in here. Remember how we thought this was, this started off so mundane. I'm like, oh great. Bad writing. I'm in here, SpongeBob, you know. Really simplistic writing. Alright. Bob. <laughs> Duo Bob! Peeked in and figured out what the prob. Why did I capitalize problem? Was. You're out of shape, Patrick. You need to exercise. So it goes from that. Like, that is the weirdest logic jump of, oh, you need to exercise, but how can I? I can, here, you can exercise your rights. That's not gonna solve his problem of needing physical exertion. I did, I forgot, like, I was so confounded when it got to the political stuff that I was confounded and forgot that that is where it started with. Can't even leave my house. Like, this must be a guy who literally, like, <laughs> he did some drugs before writing this. He's like, yeah, I'll have the kids write this. <laughs> like, this dude is working on this game. He's a late, late night. He's got to finish this in, hand it to the rest of his team. He has got to come up with some story. He's just drinking a beer. He's like, you know what would be funny? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go weird. I'm just gonna, you know, make something funky. You gotta exercise your freedom. This is a long story, too. What's a Gibby? Please look up I Gibby. It's an actual thing. Why can't you just have the type of this? Have you type the script? Today? Well, that would be much more boring. I think typing the script of the episode, uh, although could be neat, means that you know exactly what's coming up, which does not make it as interesting and surprising as these custom stories are. Um, so I prefer the custom stories for sure. They should have just put this in the main game, though. Having this be an extra mode and not be able to have progress on the main thing is, is less interesting. Alright, your... exercise your discretion. Uh, oh, that's why! So, okay, we're gonna reread this and that's gonna make more sense. So SpongeBob is saying to exercise your discretion, and Patrick's discretion is to not say anything. That makes more sense. Um... This really sounds AI written. It's kind of insane. This must be what uh what the AI learned off of is is trash like this. This is what you know like the learning models that learn how to write and how to like make art. They learn from sources like this, don't they? This this is where AI learned to type. <laughs> ChatGPT played the SpongeBob uh, typing game. That's how it learned. <laughs> Your right to vote. SpongeBob passed him a ballot. He just had one. He just had one in his back pocket. And Patrick voted. Good. Well, I don't know. Like, did did Patrick take care in voting? Like, did he did he research? Did he did he know who he was voting for? Or did he just pick a name? I don't know if Patrick was a responsible voter. Everybody, I I don't think I don't think Patrick should should vote. <laughs> oh, I don't know about that. Uh, I think I can move now. Okay, that's our that's our ending to the story. He's now exercised. Patrick cried happily. Okay. SpongeBob heard a big creak. And Patrick squeezed out from under his rock. Nice. Good job, Patrick. I'm so proud of you. You voted, you exercised your discretion. You, I don't know, I don't know what you did. Uh, Spongebob, are you ready to go to that pie eating contest now? Is that, is that literally the final lines? Is there a punchline after that, or is that it? Oh my gosh, that's the end of the story. That's so much. Hey honey, you ready to hear the best little thing that I that I had to type up just now? If you type it, or say it quickly. SpongeBob went to see Patrick one day. Patrick, he called out of SpongeBob Patrick's house. I'm here, SpongeBob, Patrick said, but I'm stuck and can't move. SpongeBob peeked in and figured out what the problem was. You're out of shape, Patrick. You need to exercise. But how can I, Patrick asked. I'm a when I can't even leave my house. 
Here, said SpongeBob, handing him a flag. You could exercise your freedom. Patrick took the flag and waved it. Hey, I think it's working, SpongeBob. You can exercise your discretion. Well, I'm not going to say anything about that, SpongeBob. Good job, Patrick. Keep going. You can exercise your right to vote. SpongeBob passed him a ballot, and Patrick voted. Hey, SpongeBob, I think I can move now. Patrick cried happily. SpongeBob heard a big creak, and Patrick squeezed out from under his rock. Okay, buddy, SpongeBob said. Are you ready to go to that pie eating contest now? End of story. What? <laughs> I have so many things, so I have to go take my dog out. All right, have fun. <laughs> Uh, I think this game was worth playing just for this. Just for that. Fight for your right to party was the title of that story. I want to print this so badly. I want I want this printed and I want to put it up on my wall. Can I like... Can I see how the print queue is going? Alright, let's get out of here. Get out, leave, back. Cool. Quit. Do you really, really yes, I want to quit. Uninstall. <laughs> we're done. Are you sure you want to completely remove SpongeBob SquarePants typing all its components? Yes, we're done. Leave it. Uh, they've all been completely removed. Thank you. It's still in my DVG drive. Okay. I can turn on. I can plug in and turn on my top monitor finally. Oh my goodness. What a day. What a freaking live stream. What a live stream. Eh. Okay, I'll look it up. Well, everybody, what did we learn today? We learned to the type. Um, we also learned that, uh, you want me to look up I Gibby? It's a fictional web show in Carly Shay's Dream. Oh, I see, okay. <sighs> what did we learn today? We learned, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what I've learned. Anyways, let's, let's, let's do some sweater burp. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, we learned that I'm not built for this. <laughs> I don't know. Was that good? Oh, we also learned... Uh, no, what I meant to say is not what we learned, but what did we do today? What we did today is we, we played some typing. Uh, I ate, like, all of this chocolate. <laughs> I ate way too much chocolate today on stream. Um, and, uh, and we lost our brain cells a little bit. We lost our brain cells while finding Patrick's, and we found his, like, will to live or something. I don't know. We found his, like, we found his stuff. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, I ate a lot of chocolate on stream. I think I ate, <laughs> I ate a lot of chocolate on stream. The Genetics Show, starring Spongebob. Sweet. I'm gonna stop recording long recording. A long recording for the freaking Spongebob typing game. Alright. Tonight show. That's the content. That's some good content, everybody. Alright. Tonight show starring Spongebob. Let's find where that is. Boop, 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 boop. Delete, delete. Awesome. And now, the art style. The art style is... I'm gonna have like an actual dinner after this. Uh, I've spent the entire stream eating chocolate because I was hungry and now I'm gonna eat a real dinner after this. I'm sorry, Steven Universe style. Steven Universe style Tonight Show. Uh, starring SpongeBob. This is not gonna be good. 
I don't think I'm gonna do this justice. Alright, Steven, universe style, remove that from the way. Alright! Ah. Did you say everything with my face on it? Gelatin? Bone marrow? Why? Why do you want me to say the things? Pushmo! Yes! Got some good music, man! Got some good music! I do my best! Find some good, fun video game sound effects and soundtracks and... I think I've had too many random letters flying through my brain for the past two hours and now I can't talk. Um... So I just want to get this wonder bark done and then call it a night. It's 9.30. I get to go to bed after this now. I worked all day. Oh, this is why streaming is getting really difficult for me. Like, sure, we have fun during the streams, but my goodness. I literally work all day up until I start live streaming. And then I stream. And then I go to bed. And then I, like, I don't... I... It's a little... That's why we've been doing a lot more one-hour live streams. So I still have a little bit of my own, like, my time. Um... So just, just as a heads up, we're going to have a lot more one-hour live streams coming up soon because life has gotten so busy for me. Um, but, but yeah, at least we're getting through these games and eventually I'll have a nice, wonderful YouTube video where I cover all these games. Um, but, but until that point, some of these games are just time spent of my life. And I do my best. I hope you guys are entertained. I do hope that, I mean, there's enough people still chatting in the live stream chat that I do hope that I'm actually providing entertainment. Um, despite how we literally played a typing game today. <laughs> I hope you guys did actually get entertained. Um, but yeah. Okay. Let's pull up some Steven Universe characters. I've never seen Steven Universe. I know it's like a really well-loved cartoon, there's a huge fan base behind it, and I know it has like a very similar style to like, um, uh, like Gravity Falls or something like that, I feel. Like that's kind of what my concept of it felt like. We're just gonna, let's just do a head shape here. The head shape's gonna be like a... Mm, that doesn't look good. like that. Just trying to basically get like the Spongebob head shape, but make it more rounded, kind of like they do with the hair of Steven. Yeah, it looks good. And then we'll do this line. And let's see, was it eight good? Yeah, eight's bad. <laughs> if anybody's wondering, an eight pixel size for the line work is very bad. Alright, five. So we'll do five for everything else as well. It's kind of crazy that 15 people are watching a grown man play a crappy Spongebob typing game. Yeah. And I appreciate all of you. <laughs> and I appreciate all of you. Alright. And then how do we do the eyes? They're kind of like egg shaped. That's actually a pretty good first try. We have to make him be a talk show host here. So we're gonna give him a suit or something. Yeah, that looks good. Uh, what do we wanna do for his talk show thing? I can be like, hello, it is I, Spongebob. We'll probably have him be like really proud. He's just gonna be like, yay. We can center the mouth a bit more on his face now, or the entire face. We'll center the face more on his face. Oh yeah, that's a good song.
Um, do they have eyebrows? They do have eyebrows. All the time in the world. I've only got six minutes. All right. Now, how do we do a body with this cartoon? This looks so weird. sleeve here and then the hands how do they do their hands all right uh oh we're gonna have a five-fingered spongebob watch out everybody all right good enough good enough for government work So Oh gosh, I don't like how far away that is. Like can I can I fix? We're going to make him very squat though because he's still like SpongeBob. And then other hand. I'm kind of totally stealing a pose of Steven Universe, and that's kind of it's like. I'm making it very easy for myself by just stealing that pose, but it works ironically really well for a, our talk show. All right, let's fill in behind. Okay, we'll do dark blue here. The Uncle Grandpa and Steven Universe did collab. I did not know about that. We're gonna give him, we'll give him his actual tie color. But I'm gonna give him a bow tie. This isn't Mario Kart, is it? Cause it kind of sounds like Mario Kart. Fill this in, and now the legs. What do we do for his legs? Um, he's just a short little man. We'll give him the regular SpongeBob shoes. Does regular Wonder if shoes look good in this style? I guess they don't really do that, do they? But I will give him his little, like, shiny spot. You know, like, Spongebob has his little shiny spot. I'm surprised I'm actually able to jump onto this art style this quickly and do it that well. I kind of got it. All right. And now, 
a logo, I guess. Um, here, there's a background. And we're gonna go with, uh, like, stage background. entire thing. Paste. That's not the way I wanted to paste it. Uh, I'm gonna try something really quick. I don't know if I can do this in time. I can't. Uh, linear gradient and then make this be zero transparency. Good. And then fill that. And then fill this, but then, where is it? Where's the control tool? I know it's somewhere in here. Gosh, I haven't used this in so long. No, it's this one, isn't it? Ah, 30 seconds. Great transform. Yes. Oh my gosh, I haven't used this tool in forever. Good. And then fill this one, and then gradient control tool, squish, rotate, squish. How does that look? Ooh, sort of. Sort of looks cool. Almost cool. All right. So normally we go over time with a background color. I'm gonna go over time with one thing. Here's here's my overtime. You ready? I'm gonna go with a yellow. I'm gonna make it, let's say 43% transparency. And it's just gonna do this. One line, one line. And fill it in. Oh, does it, 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 it didn't continue drawing when it went off screen. Now, just fill it in. And there we are. It, it could probably be centered. What can I move and what can't I? What layer is that on? Can I move it now? There we go. Yay! I can't believe it actually turned out kind of good. <laughs> I got gradients in there and everything. All right. Maybe, maybe the SpongeBob typing game unlocked a portion of my brain I didn't have control of earlier. Maybe I'm just more capable and... Oh, I shut off right there. No, that's all I've got for today, everybody. I am as tired as I can possibly be. I thank you all for being here. I have no idea what we're going to do this Saturday. Um, <laughs> I have no idea. Like, straight up, I was setting up for this live stream right beforehand. It's a re there was a reason this whole live stream was an hour late. That entire hour was just me trying to get the game to work. Because um, I, I went from working, I was working my job, and then I set up the live stream for an hour, and then I did the live stream. And so, now I get to go to bed and, and work in the morning again. Whee! But I had fun! And I appreciate y'all being here, because, I mean, at the end of the day, live streaming is only fun because you guys are here. So, thank you all for being here. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. And without further ado, stay hydrated. Stay safe out there. Uh, there's a lot of... <laughs> as we learned from the fish earlier, if you skip school, you're gonna get eaten. Great moral to learn for today's live stream. Bye! <laughs> Have a good one. Woo!